Welcome to the Ghost Town Pumpkin Festival. Um, I'm glad that this game is always here every Halloween. It's This is what I'm aiming for with Snow Job. I want to make my own version of this, but for snow in the winter. That, I, again, Snow Job will be done. It's the whole reason why I'm making it. It's why I want that. <clears throat> now, what is this game? Well, it's a game where you can carve pumpkins. Last year, I didn't carve a single pumpkin. <laughs> I actually realized, thinking back to it, I was like, I, I didn't carve a single pumpkin. You may notice that I'm not really in a Halloween costume. It's because we have a date later to date a later today with some very special characters so i can't be in my halloween costume but we're at the reception let's say so we're gonna go check things out see what the pumpkins are like and there's a new escape room in this that should take about two hours to finish so it's gonna be very interesting um however before we even begin we need to design a ghost and carve some pumpkins now what's interesting about this game is that it's such a very simple concept right the concept is just a game that's about hanging out in a shared world where you carve pumpkins and you get to be with other people. It looks suspicious. Hey, I got hats. Oh, yeah, cool. Um, let's go for like a cool hat here. Do I go for cowboy or spider? That is amazing. No, but I don't want to be like, you know, very, very loop. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you don't want to be too loud because then people are going to make fun of you. What is this? That The hat needs to be unlocked in the festival. Huh? You do want something that's a bit more... Uh, uh, Un underspoken you don't want to be too crazy about it because if you're too mm, you're too oh I, I can be a sexy nurse actually and my mouth can be um <laughs> wait what where did my eyes begin and where did my where did my eyes begin and where does my mouth end Right? That just looks like a pair of titties. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Like, but I need some. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. That's absolutely be beautiful. Now this game is actually free, so you can actually download it yourself and join me as well. Um, and we can do all kinds of things together. But first, let's actually make a cool pumpkin. This year, I'm going to choose a small pumpkin. Because last time, it took us a very long time to make something. And uh, I actually don't know what to make for like a pumpkin scrape. What's what's scraping? Oh, it's like a pencil. I'll go lighting. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should be like this. Uh, more screenshots. Oh, I'm good. What's interesting is that I'm sure people are drawing some of the craziest things in, in this game. And it makes you wonder how people are so good at this art stuff. Because I don't even know how to begin drawing with with a pumpkin. Oh, I could make it look like some of these, like, peeking through, right? So maybe I can do it from, from that side. I need to see where's the other opposite side. So, like, here, right? Is that it? Found it. Okay, good. So that's the hole. So I need to go down there. I'll make it like a little goblin is... Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. Yeah, it's looking kind of good. Okay, I cut too much out, actually. I, I realize what I need to do is this. I need to go... Oh, you know what? I need to think about the negatives. I need to do like a... Look at this. I need to do an outline. How do you do an outline in this? I think this is the same problem that I had last year. <laughs> I don't think I ever solved this. But I, I remember this being kind of a complicated bit to do. And I, I, and I remember being lost at this as well. Oh my god, it actually worked this year. Oh yes, here we go, perfect. There we go, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do uh, some eyes. And just a very wanting mouth. Like a very... Whenever someone opens their mouth now... I'm not gonna call them a mouth breather. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna say, wow, you're really wanting today, huh? It's <laughs> Ooh, there's a ghost in my pumpkin. <laughs> and we'll do like fingers like hanging on. Like he's like he's like gripping, you know what I mean? Like gripping, he's like he's like gripping he he's like gripping the side of the pumpkin. And in in relation to to the mouth. 
so when you look inside it's like a whole different world that's cool do uh like this is this too much like a penis that's much like a penis right this is this is legal right? it's legal am i the problem am i the reason why they have moderation What's interesting about this game and just the idea of like, I guess, weirdly weird holiday traditions is that you don't really get them anymore, right? Like, I mean, Christmas trees are kind of hard for people to afford in, in the first place. It's hard to get like a bunch of things going all the, the, all, all the time. So it's nice to have like a virtual stand-in for it, which is a, a good way to keep the spirit going, if that makes sense. Okay, now the problem is that the square is... Did I fill the square up? I guess you can't really fill the square up. Uh, I can carve him out. But same thing with Halloween. Like, the ho Halloween nowadays, I tend to find the trick-or-treating experience is dead. Like, getting candy is cringe. And I don't know why. Like, the younger generations just, just don't do it anymore. Right? Everyone just wants to do, like, the mewing face or the mogging face now. And, like, you know, you see, uh, 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 and, you know... Even earlier, it used to be all about, like, dancing and the gritty and stuff. No one wants to go and get free candy or, like, you know, ruin someone's house by throwing eggs at it. It's not, it's not the same anymore. It's not that lead being gone, right? Now there's no more lead and gasoline. No one's violent anymore. No one gets, like, angry when you don't get candy anymore. So no one eggs their house or, like, throws stuff away anymore. Oh, it doesn't change the look on this side. Hmm. Oh, I should do like a shadow panorama actually. Uh, maybe I do more. I, I do want to cut out like more of this. Maybe, like, I really fucked up here. <laughs> Can I just fix this? Okay, well, this is a disaster now. All right, now this is a disaster. Okay, let's think about how to, how to salvage this. How do we salvage this? Uh, window. We'll do like a, a window. Oh, it can be a window that looks like a Resident Evil logo, right? Like, what's that? You know what I mean? Like that Las Plagas symbol or something? What does it look like again? It's like this, and then there's like a weird little thingamabob over here. Alright, well, I just messed up. It's because I, it's because I started off on the wrong foot. Like, I started off, like, cutting a hole to get my, like, st my stability. And I, and, and, I, and I forgot to fix it. Oh, wait! It's a spooky eye. It's a spooky eye. All right, here we go. Yeah, it's a spooky eye. Yeah, here we, there we go. But yeah, like Halloween just feels very like, I don't know. Empty now. No one really wants to go outside and like be a little spooker. Everyone's always like st stuck at home and just hanging out and stuff. Which is cool. Like staying home isn't bad, but like. I just know it's like it's very hard for people to want to like get into the into the making cost like making costumes bit or or making um or like decorating house a bit. To be fair, it's also like everything's really expensive, so it's not really the easiest. But uh, you know what it is? The economy's <laughs> it's the economy. I wish I miss when things were easier and like things were fun and things could have like, you know, cool stuff in them. Uh not like they they still can't, but I recognize that it's just way too hard for people to get into it now because it's, you know, you walk into a spirit Halloween, right? One, there's way too much Beetlejuice stuff now. My wife and I still have to watch it, and I feel like I'm being spoiled. Two, prices are going way up. Three. Actually, besides that, like, what other... Horror, horror movies were, like, good this year, right? There was Alien and Romulus, which I heard was really fantastic. And I'd be mean, I'd be mean to watch it for a while now. But aside from that and, like, Beetlejuice, there's not really much else that I remember hearing was, like, a great horror movie. Like, I remember the days of The Blair Witch Project. Or... Uh, the Last Exorcism. When people would go out as like parties to be like, all right, let's go watch Last Exorcism 27. Let's go. A scary movie and stuff. Maybe, maybe it's just dead. Maybe Halloween is just gone now. I don't know.
Do a little blush. Do like an ooh look. It's a little it's a little bit wonky. It's a little bit wonky. Yeah, what's like a good horror movie this year actually? Maybe we just go back to the classics and we watch something like new. Horror movies 2024 that were really like acclaimed. Smile 2, Never Let Go, The Platform 2, Rippy, Hold Your Breath, The Beast Within. Okay, I, I thought The Beast Within was a comic book movie. The Deliverance, Bezel, The Inheritance, The Demo, what? The Demo Disco, oh, the, the, the Demon Disorder, Bagman, that's funny. The Watchers, It's What's Inside, Arcadian, Cuckoo, Oddity. Immaculate, The Front Room, Abigail. I heard Abigail was okay, and I saw like a movie recap of it, and I was like, it's not really my, my uh, movie, but it seemed all right. It's one of those movies that like I can see how it's horror theme because it's like vampires, but just because it's vampires doesn't mean it's a horror movie. And that's the thing, right? I think some things are just classified as a horror movie when it's not really a horror movie. Like to me, Abigail feels more like an action film. Though to be fair... The first, wait, the first Omen. Is this a remake? Was it the first Omen or was it the last Omen? What was the one with the, with the kid when, you know, and the father's trying to kill his like, kid because his kid is like the, the Satan? It's a really old movie. All I remember from that movie, actually, his wife, at some point in the movie, his, his wife dies, right? Very sad. Um, but the thing that stuck out to me about that movie and his wife dying was uh his when his wife died the fake blood that they used so that day i had subway sandwiches for breakfast and i love the hot sauce from well i i love the hot sauce from subway from a subway it was like a very particular brand of it and i recognized the color of that blood and i was like wait that's just subway sandwich hot sauce and then i started like role playing as the father because i could do a pretty good impression of the father back then and I was like, my wife is a Subway sandwich or something. And it was a stupid in-joke for the like Gary's, but... How about the IRL web, uh, webcam pumpkin carving stream? It's very, very hard to find a pumpkin. Um, it's also very, very hard to motivate me to want to carve it. It's a very messy process. Uh, I'd be down. But I, I, I would need to figure out what to do with the rest of the pumpkin. So maybe. I'll figure out... If, if, if I can find a cheap pumpkin, then sure. But I, I usually hate pumpkin carving. Pumpkin carving is not my favorite activity. <laughs> I enjoy the dressing up part and actually trying to scare people thing. The problem is that nowadays, if you try to scare people in my city, you're more likely to be punched in the face, which is a bit sad, but that's sort of the way that the, that the community has, has it gone. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> See, get it? Ooh, ooh. Ooh, like a ghost and then ooh. Hello, chat. How are you? How are you? <laughs> See? Everyone loves that emote. Everybody loves that emote. Let's visit the festival. Let's go see what everyone's doing today. Flashlight camera mode. Camera mode? Yo. Welcome to the classic world. What's the classic world? What is this pumpkin? Mildly unpleasant. Mildly pleasant pumpkin. How do I stop? Okay. What? What does that say? Scientifically unreal pumpkin. I don't know what that says. Grand festival? I don't know. That is insane. Look, look at this. Uh, you think I can compete in real life with this shit? Hell no. To be fair, this guy has no more pumpkin left. <laughs> I don't know if they have. Does it, is it still a pumpkin if there's nothing left? I'm not, I'm not really sure. Also, is there? There's no open mic, right? Okay, thank, thank God. Uh, I'm, I like that. It's good. It's really good, actually. Chat. Here we go. Oh, yes, I remember. It's that uh, the hard code chat thing. What is this? What? Wondrously gorgeous pumpkin. H Huyo. There's going to be so many memes I don't un understand. What is this? There's going to be so many memes I won't know. Mushrooms? That's a that's a solid scream. Uh, read me. Welcome to the 1004th Pumpkin Festival. Look for new areas like the Maze of Madness and the Hayride of Horror. 
You can submit six more pumpkins to the festival today. Six more. So we can go all oh, this this whole way, okay? And remember, it's a multiplayer game, so you can join. Link is pinned in the chat. We play the guessing game, Haunted House. Recognize this photo. We can come back to that spot. We can come back to that spot for a, a, a on Halloween night for a surprise. So on Halloween night, we'll all be uh, there, I think. By the, I'm assuming by the, by, by the red sign. Hey, Ride of Horror, the maze of, we did the maze of madness last time. The new thing is the haunted house. So we gotta go find the haunted house. I'm gonna assume the haunted house is here around the, 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 the hair of the horror. That is insane. What the? Cause, okay, it's one thing to draw, right? It's another thing to draw by using a knife tool that allows you to cut things out. That to me is impressive, all right? And the detail on this, really good. You can really see the details. You can tell what's hair and what's not. This, the details are super, this could be a painting. Wow. And it even has a horror theme. You have a fairy who's gonna suck the soul out of you and a skeleton, very nice. I don't know what this means. Sorry, Oh my God, it's a hippo. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just like it because it's a, it's hippo. Reserved. I'm assuming reserved for those who make a good pumpkin. Yeah. It really is. It an Among Us duck? Is that Mu Dang? Oh, that's yeah, that's his name, Mu Dang. You're right. It is Mu 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 Dang. Why did Mu Dang get popular? <laughs> he was my, he was me and my wife's greatest secret. What the hell is that? Regular Jolly Pumpkin. Like, even this. Like, how do you get this? They do the texturing so well that it looks like fur, but even even if you if you look at it at a certain angle, it looks like fur. It's good. Sussamogus. I'm not gonna... I refuse to like these at the principle. Because these have been... Uh, these have these have infiltrated society and the culture. Wu then got popular because she's a cute little jelly bean. Uh, sure, she's underage. Is that, a, is that a bikini cat? Yeah, I like that. Yippee! These are cool. Never gonna give you... God, God damn it. Yeah, she's a very adorable creature. It's funny, because as she grows up, she becomes a very terrifying monster. You, did, did you know hippos can run really fast? And that they can easily bite through your bones? Oh, that's a good face. You ever see that image? My office at a pumpkin club. There we go. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Fuck, where is it? Oh my god, TikTok. The TikTok links take over my fucking history. I hate it so much. Anyways, there's this one particular image that was always funny to me. This idea of... Um, uh, somebody posted this thing where it was like they, had like... they had like a pumpkin carving contest in their office. And then the, the caption is like, I, I work in, in an office full of really professional artists. And this was, the, this was the picture that won. And it's just a face that's just like this. Same deal. Just a very, like, funny, cutesy face. There's a ghost. Chat, there's a ghost. Hello. Boo! Uh. Hee 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 hee. Do you think I'm... Do you think I'm nice? <laughs> ah, can you put the jump scare with me, please? Ah... How do, I, how do I revert my size? She's, she's a pygmy hippo, so that's so she's not dangerous. What is the difference between a pygmy hippo and a normal hippo? Do pygmy hippos just never eat people? Like, look at this. Look. It's invaded our culture. It's invaded our world. These, the, the Among Us, Sussy Among Us. They've broken us. They've changed us as a, as a society. We can't have a single conversation anymore. I can't say the, like, I can't even make the sound sus as part of anything, right? 
Like I, I can't say Sussifus or something. Or like, what's another word with the, the word Sussifus? Cleat, cleat, uh, su, uh, su, su, sus, size and habitat and biology. Susan, yeah, like I can't, like you can't say the name Sussin anymore because people are gonna pronounce it su, sussy or like Sussin. You can't say sushi anymore because then people say say like. Sushi? It's not the same anymore. I want to report this, but it's doing nothing wrong. Is there is there a report option for I don't like this? <laughs> uh, Fortnite there is? Oh no. Oh no. What happened? You know, in a couple of years' time, this is going to be fused. Oh my god. Somebody should make the mewing face. I should make the mewing face. Okay, remind me. We need to make the mewing face after. We're going to draw the mewing face. With the whole finger thing, right? Up in your thing, going down your chin, going down your chin. I should do that after. We'll do a mewing face after. I'm I, I, I'm gonna contribute to the brain rot. <laughs> you get one scary pumpkin from me, and then a non-scary pumpkin. So this is, I think, the the bond of terror. I think this is the same thing as last time. Let's see. Yeah, it is. Lol, Lamal. Hey, a new pumpkin spawned. Oh shit, new pumpkins are spawning le left and the. Uh, why is this gonads. What are these holes? Is there a real anatomy? Is there a real anatomy? There's no way skeletons have those holes, right? On the sides? Like, what, 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 purpose, what purpose does it serve? Can I feel my own skeleton? Chat, I want you to put your hands into your pelvis. Like, put your hand, like, close to your vagina or your, or your balls. Like, try, try, try to find these two flat bones. Do you have flat bones? I can't tell if this is a flat bone. Those are the balls holes. <laughs> yeah, where's all the women skeleton then? Where are all the bitches? Okay, that's... Especially classic pumpkin. You recently looked through Telegram's report options, and besides the usual ones you would expect, it has "I don't like it" and it's not illegal, but it must be taken down. <laughs> That's what this this game should have. That it's not illegal, but it should be taken down. <laughs> like it's bad for the culture. It should have various options like that. Yeah. I'd say Telegram is doing is doing the smart thing, but I feel like I'd be on a list. Hello! Oh wow, you look look. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that shape. Look at that shape. Look at that shape. I'm gonna freak. <laughs> Let's check out. Let's freak. Look at that shape. That shape was amazing. I'm in this photo and I don't like it. Yeah, I should have an option like that. I'll see. Oh, you know what should have been inside here? A sussy among us, you know, to really sell the deal. Ah, <sighs> am I the problem? Maybe. Let's go, uh, let's go inside here. What? You dare. You if you dare. You dare refuse my my bacho? What the what the fuck is a bacho? You dare refuse my bacho? Oh, battle challenge from BattleTech. Oh, <laughs> that's, that's interesting. God, such a it's crazy how successful that this game is too. Because like again, that's a lot of pumpkins. Ever, so many people people made these pumpkins, right? And which means every year people are waiting to like do to do this. You know what it is. Does VR chat have any like Halloween stuff? Hey, VR chat people, is there gonna be like a really cool ha ha Halloween event? Because if so, maybe it's time we celebrate Halloween in the VR chat. Tons? What's like the biggest one? What's the best one in your purview? And you can't say yours. Unless it is the biggest one, in which case say yours. Tons and none at all. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> who do I believe? Because. Again, like in real life, it's kind of hard to go and like do this stuff. And we do celebrate Halloween up there, our group of people. Yeah, but like, 
I can't stream that. It'd be weird to stream like a closed gathering. So it's like, I can't farm you for content. You know, so you don't mean anything to me. I'm just <laughs> Can you imagine? Can you imagine if I said that? I can't stream you for content, so you mean nothing to me. <laughs> like, imagine how cruel that would be. I can't stream you for content, so you mean nothing to me. Hey, uh, what do you bring to the, what do you bring to the table? <laughs> can you, uh, can you get me views? <laughs> No, but like I would, I would join. But I think on Halloween Day, it'd be kind of tough for me. I can't stay for long, anyways. But especially because I think I, I also want to enjoy it with the rest of the, uh, of the chat too. So I don't want to like invade that space with my own chat. But I also want to celebrate it with chat if we do celebrate it. So thank you for the invite, but it has to be a no for me. But I will. I don't know. I'll just say hi, I guess, inside that chat. Let's be like hello. Knife backwards is a liar. <laughs> You know what? Your name is Fran. Backwards, which is the best character from Final, from Final Fantasy XII. From, from Final Fantasy XII. What is this? Well, we will talk about it in our server, so we will see. Yeah, Fran. Best character in the, in the game. What's all this? Hey, there's a little hut here. Ah, this place got, like, large. But, yeah. It's also, like, it's mainly why I don't want to, like, I don't know, like, invade too many spaces. Because it's, like, I have very different goals with what I'm trying to do versus, like, what people want to celebrate. I'm dead. This is hollow. Oh, I can just fly. And I don't want to, like, warp it. Especially if it's, like, a traditional thing. I don't want to warp it too much. How do we, how do we get up here? Oh. Let's take a photo together. Okay. Oh, okay. Or yes. Yes way. You think I'm spooky? I do. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Selfie cam. Selfie cam. Ready, ready, ready? Say, uh, say... Say cheese. Uh, how do I zoom? How do I zoom? I'm a spooky ghost. <laughs> I know you're a spooky ghost. I know that you're a spooky ghost. Let's just change the filter. You. Ha uh, you are so. You're you're so silly. Do <laughs> you want to die? <laughs> I'm getting out of here. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. Oh god! I can't die again. I've only just re respawned as a ghost. I've only just respawned as a ghost. I have to leave. Oh god. They're gonna kill me. <laughs> I, have to, I have to run. You were so silly. My legs, they don't work like they used to. But yeah, I, I've always found virtual events would be a, a lot cooler. At least in my mind, like a virtual Hall Halloween event must be fun. So maybe we'll find some public ones in the VR chat, but or maybe we'll we'll uh, make our own just for the chat, right? Because I think everyone likes Halloween here. It you know what it is? Halloween is the one time of the year that I can do cosplay for very cheap, and it, and like everyone's in on it, right? Fun. What's this? I thought I said good cock. My mind is rotted. No. Come on, come on. Just just a small just just a small jump. Just a little jump. Just a small, just a small, just a <laughs> Just a small jump. We can make it. Oh. You know what we have to do this year? For next year. It's too late now, but I thought there was more Halloween songs, so I didn't bother. I think we need to record our own spooky monster album. So I recognize that just not enough whole, there's just not enough like spooky songs. I'm I'd rather be watching anime. <laughs> Eek. I'd rather be watching anime. Oh no. 
Oh, see that? It's a little bit of a, it's a little bit of a, a sneaky beaky, sneaky beaky like. Yeah. What they say? My favorite dessert is ice cream. My favorite. Uh, I need like a thing. I'm gonna. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Yeah, this is not easy. What are they saying? Do you think I'm a? Fr do you think I'm a what? Do, do wait. Do you wanna wait? Do you, do you wanna? Do you wanna go slow? <laughs> oh, that's how they said. Do you wanna die? <laughs> I forgot about that. Want to pet the dog together? Yes way! Do you wanna... You wanna die? <laughs> what a crazy statement. <laughs> this! Check this out! I don't have friends. That's funny. Uh, friends. I'm with my friends. See, you don't have friends, but I'm with my friends. Unless I fall, in which case it's your fault. Oh, that's a bit of a sticky situation. Oh, okay, we have a checkpoint. Okay, good. We're in. Oh, it goes even higher. Okay, wait, wait, wait. There's even better pumpkins up there. I guarantee it. What? We've been trying to reach you about your... Your car's... Extended warranty. It's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. This really is like the Benefati game. It's the same vibe. There's no difference. It's all the same game. I think that game broke people. You know what I mean? Like, not in like a bad way. But I recognize that the game did lasting damage to people. Because, like, I think for a long time in people's lives, they had nothing that they were struggling to, like, to, like strive for, right? So a lot of people didn't really feel like they had something to, like, to, to, like aim for. And then Bennett Foddy made um, getting over it. And then it became this, like, cultural phenomenon. And it gave people purpose where they had none before. Wow, that's also my favorite flavor. <laughs> uh oh. I'm going to come back to this later. <laughs> I'm just letting them know. I'm also going to die. <gasps> I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. This way. Check this out. Hey, why are you so good at this? You're... You're so... You're so cool. Show off. <laughs> Trying to one-up me in my stream. Huh? Trying to be so cool compared to me. Huh? Trying to take all my goddamn viewers. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> no, come back, come back, come back, come back. You are so... Wait, you are so full of sadness? What is this? You are so pop culture referencing. <laughs> you are so creepy! <laughs> I... You are so... Have you seen... Have you seen the... Have you seen the internet sensation? Mu Deng? Have you seen the internet sensation Mu Deng? I'm surprised that every year... Okay, so one thing that this game is like... It's always been missing, right? Surprised that every year they don't include various phrases that are references to pop culture. Like Mu Deng or something. Or like mogging. Because then you could say stuff like, you know, you are so mewing. <laughs> What's it say? Do you, how about football? Uh, I'm looking for a secret place. I, what's like a question underscore? How do you, hey, you made it. Let's go. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Come, come, come. Let's follow. Godspeed.
Yes way. Yes way. Let's freak. Let's freak. Let's freak. Let's freak out. Let's go. Fake pins. Obby Tower. More like no problem. Obby Tower. Huh. Uh, can I get a double, double chunk, chunk chocolate, chocolate blumpkin, blumpkin uh, extra felt, felt and a side of Quandale chungus aioli? Uh, the Aki way? <laughs> um, what the Sigma? Hi. Uh, W order, by Thanks, the way. Thanks, you too. <laughs> What's your app? Oh, um, Libby Don. Libby Don. Uh, a baby grunk. <laughs> it's nice to meet you. Uh, what are you doing in a map like this? <laughs> Stop, you're so chalant. I'm sorry to be so chalant. It's just, you've got a level 10 Yeah, No glaze. <laughs> you're too enjoying <laughs> No, no, no. Really, really. I... Have we met before? I don't know. Were you the the, the Peter, Peter Griffin, Griffin skin in the only up obby? <laughs> That's sorry. I just had the <laughs> with the pin. You now equip a special hat to show the pins you've collected. Okay, it's cool. Okay, let's go get the pins. That's a beautiful D twenty. Wow, the game. Can I report this? Look at that internet sensation. <laughs> yes way. <laughs> Let's let's uh, let's get out of here. Okay, well we we got the pin. That's cool. Look at that thing. You you mean you mean spit on that thing? You mean the hawk tour? Can I go like a yeehaw? Look, look at that thing. Look at that main character. <laughs> what main character? That's a weird pumpkin. Okay, we have to get some more more things. I bet you the tower has or something. I should have said I'm gonna die. I should have said I should have said I'm going to die before I jumped off. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. There's nothing here. Hey look, there's a second floor to this building. What? I'm actually surprised that like in general. Cities don't really do much of anything uh, wild with like the new. With, in the digital age, one would expect they would be doing newer things with this stuff. Like more, I don't know, like events in a digital virtual world with the people. Ooh. This is the way. Because I feel like it'd be a good time, you know? That is amazing. Because it's like a nice all, all alternative. Actually, in Toronto, we, we, what we usually have is like these pumpkin patches. You, you like go to these pumpkin patches, like grab things. This is okay, but it's not, it's not, the, it's not the coolest thing ever. It has issues. It gets very cold, too, here. Although, I guess not now, not really, but... When it gets really cold, it's hard to it's hard to keep on going. But it's just I don't know. There's just, there's just something about it. it. It feels like it hasn't been a huge thing for a while, and it feels like even before COVID, right? Like COVID definitely killed most of the vibes of going out. But specifically, even before COVID, Halloween just felt like it was falling out of out of, out of favor. Nobody, no one, no one wants to be afraid anymore. Everyone's always like, ooh. I don't want to shit my pants today. And it's like, come on, that's, that's half the fun. You want to shit your pants? I love pooping. Excuse me? Who said that? Oh, man, no. Oh. Let's say I got it fairly. Fair and square. Oh, that's cool. That's... This dog is a friend. That. Look at that. Look at that friend. I beat the Maze of Madness and all I got was his t-shirt. Why is he sitting so sexually? Please look after this dog while I am gone. Yes. Let's just look at this. Okay, I want you to look at this and then think about this and, and then listen to this. 
look at this and listen to this at, at the same time, okay? I understand that quite a few of you out there are dealing with a pornography addiction. If you are struggling, I just want you to know, good. Recognizing that you have an addiction is the first step towards recovery, so stop recognizing. Remember that just because you have an addiction, that doesn't mean you have to quit. We're human, and humans are prone to making mistakes. You think jerking it is a mistake? If it weren't for mistakes, you wouldn't even be here. What's important is that you clean up after the mess you make. Uh... Where's my pumpkin? Uh... Uh... Watch out! I don't know where my pumpkin is. I also... I'm gonna leave because I feel dirty. It's like... It's like... It's like leaving... It's like leaving your room, okay? After you've just nutted. And you have to talk to somebody. And it's like, I, I don't know if we can have a conversation right now. Like, I just nutted. <laughs> like, I, I'm not in the right mind space to, to like talk to you. It's like, I, I listen, I have to wash my hands, sorry. Do not shake, do not shake it. Hey, there's a pin. I lost myself in a maze. LOL, where, where am I? Hey, we're getting, we're getting a, lot of, a lot of pins. Now, where's this, this escape room thing? What's funny is that the maze goes kind of far. Like, you can go in that corner even and get lost. Holy shit, this maze is massive. Imagine someone's lost in this maze for so long. They're in the corner. Oh my god. Wait, okay, wait, 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 wait. wait. I'm gonna... Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna die! I'm a spooky ghost. <laughs> oh, I fell. Oh no, oh no, I fell. One thing I really want to bring back, which doesn't really happen anymore, or, or, around where I am. Oh, I got gnomed. In case of emergency, hit me up. I'll bring you back to safety. Um, the thing I really want to do that no, no, that we haven't done in a very long time is a real maze, like a like a hedge maze, like a, like a I don't know, like a spooky maze. No one, no one really does mazes anymore. He's really wanting. That is a wanting mouth. Want to dance together? <laughs> I love, I love being hold down with my boys and girls. Up by the, oh. Look at the rats. Oh, look at them. They're so disgusting. I love them. What's the thing again? Was it children of the... It's not children of the... Children of the wastes? Children of the something? There's something about that, like, phrase. Children and then rats. Know this. Ride may be too spooky for children under 10. Where's the... Where's the ride? Oh, there it is. Hey, hey. I'm gonna freak! What? What'd they say? Look at that internet sensation! <laughs> I'm gonna... I'm gonna cry! Oh no, it's spooky in here. Oh, the spider is... Oh! I'm gonna scream! I'm so scared, I'm gonna... I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna ah, it's <laughs> was that last was that that last year too, Michael Morbius? Ah. Uh... Hey champ, I'm gonna need you to work late tonight. Hey champ, thanks for the TPS reports. That really is a nightmare to me. It's working late overtime. I'm gonna think. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna. Th I'm gonna think. I'm gonna think is such a funny phrase. <laughs> uh, 
<gasps> Spooky, scary witch. The witch is hidden. Oh no. No way. Ah. <laughs> Congratulations, you survived the hair, the hair of the horror. I sub I, I screamed on the ha haunted hay ride. You know what? This sign reminds me of like you know, because like these places. It's funny because it's like the stereotypical movie thing is you have like a pockmarked, like face teenager who has like like acne all over and say. Okay, thanks for going on the haunted hayride. Uh, please take your pin. Thank you. Bye. That's what I half expect from this. But there's no other like NPCs. It's just, it's just machines. It's all machines. You know what this is? The reason why we're all dead and the reason why everything is being run by machines. This is the future of AI. <laughs> the future of AI content is that humanity dies, becomes like a a, a long like a foregone conclusion. No one exists anymore. We're all, we're all gone. Oh, look. It's a sucking plant. Wait. In the Pokemon leaks, did it say anything about this plant? This thing must give amazing. I'm surprised the Pokemon leaks like, talk about, ty ty about Typhlosion and not that thing. Uh, a Bellsprout. Eat gum and bees. What? Oh, it's a cool cat. That's a good award. I wonder what the awards are given for. Like, how do you give awards out? Is that a... Is that a jalapeno? Remember, remind me to make a pumpkin about mogging. We need to add to the, uh, to the, to the degeneracy here. It's incredibly important that we mog. I need to mog the shit out of people. My goal is to get to the top of your mogging. Oh, look at that. That's actually kind of cool. If only I could read what that is. Very detailed. Ooh. <laughs> this was small. This is running around. Grim. Is that, is that Five Nights or Freddy? Hey, this is the mansion. The haunted mansion. Okay, cool. So we found the mansion. We didn't go in there last because it's new, right? You do the newest things last. I understand that quite a few of you out there are dealing with a pornography addiction. If you are struggling, I just want you to know, good. Recognizing that you have an addiction is the first step towards recovery, so stop recognizing. Remember that just because you have an addiction, that doesn't mean you have to quit. We're human, and humans are prone to making mistakes. You think jerking it is a mistake? If it weren't for mistakes, you wouldn't even be here. What's important is that you clean up after the mess you make. Every day is a new opportunity to start fresh. Real life. There's something wrong with me. <laughs> I used to be normal, right? I used to be a normal, like a normal person. I used to enjoy things for the things that they were. Now I can't stop helping setting myself in the, in the links. Hey, look, we can be like a little family of uh, witches and wizards. Somebody, so we could hold hands, and then somebody could be the cat that sits, uh, that sits sp suspiciously on both of our laps. Hmm. There's a secret up there. I guarantee you. What's that? Oh, it's a dog! Oh my god, it's a dog! It's a dog! Come here. Oh my god, it's a dog! Come here. Oh, it's a dog! It's a dog! It's a dog! Chad, we found a dog! Come here! Come here, boy! Come here, boy! Oh, it's a little doggy! This little doggy! This dog is a girl! It's such a little... It's such a little doggy! Come here! 
Give me. Wait, you're the same size as the uh, dog. Okay, dog, eat him. Dog, eat that ghost. Eat it. Eat the ghost. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. The dog is a friend. I wanted to eat you. I wanted to eat you. It's gonna eat you. Oh, it's too high up. It's a whole different level. Come here. Come here, doggy. <laughs> yes way. They can't be eaten. Come here, doggy. Come here. How do I do this? How do I zoom out far enough? Okay, I, I need it's both. Wait, say cheese, say cheese. Oh wait, sorry. Uh, 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 say cheese. That's a bit of a shame. It. I'm <laughs> hey, come back! Hey, come back! Look at my dog. Look, look at my dog. Is it a client side only dog? Can we? I'm sad if it's a client side on only dog. That's a cool pumpkin. Look, it's so cute. Look at that. Oh. Want to ask me? Want to ask me to play the guessing game? Uh, is there a way to say not really? That sounds a lot less like harsh. No, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know if I, if I want to play the guessing game. <laughs> We've been stuck here for a very long time. If we play the guessing game, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so. I'm so complacent. <laughs> Want to think together? Uh, let's let's do it together. You have to go pet the dog. Pet it, pet it, pet it. Pet it. I'm curious if like they can pet the the uh, the uh, dog, or is it stuck with the me? Or maybe everyone has their own dog. To be fair, imagine that you're a dog that like dies, right? Do you really want everyone to see you? No. Do you only want your best friend to, to, to see you, right? Only best friends can see best friends. That's why I'll see no one in heaven. <laughs> I'll be alone in heaven. <laughs> I'm going to be alone up there. <laughs> I'll have nobody in my life. Except for my wife. <laughs> she might just leave me up there. How do I climb this? Ooh, look particularly crusty. Come on, boy. Who's a good boy? I got this. <gasps> I'm a genius. Ha! -ha. There we go. Okay, now we gotta go up here. It's not high enough. You gotta go over there. No! What a shame. Why do I enjoy this so much? There's something about this experience. Just such a simple experience. L sorry for stepping on you. Just need a moment here. Pretty sure I did this last year, but I can't recall. If there's one thing that I hate about getting older, it's that you really forget more. What? What'd you say? Do you think I'm... You're... So... You are so... Cute. You are so cute. That little tiny creature following me. I have two tiny creatures following me, actually. Very good. What's a kilometer? <laughs> no, I can't do it. Like, it's every, every joke report takes up developer time. I need to save it for the really egregious stuff, like penises. Filthy cocks. <laughs> filthy cocks. All the place. Just fucking filthy cocks. All the place. But there has to be an option like this. Like this hurts me. You know what I mean? Like I just want the option to tell them that it hurts me. There should be two awards. There should, there should be an award for the best most liked thing. And then an award for the thing that, that hurts you the most. Right boy? The girl? What's funny? Actually no. Girl. Both my dogs have been girls. Hmm. 
We're going to the, to the haunted house. Let's see how it is. Goodbye, cute ghost. Small ghost, wherever you are. I'll miss you. I'll miss you. I saw them flying away. <laughs> I saw their like tiny little body flying away. This should be the way to the haunted house, right? Here we go. Am I, am I correct? Am I wrong? Okay. Do you want, do you want to come with me? Or do you want to stay outside? You don't really have, you don't really have a choice, do you? This is a great feature, by the way. Hidden dog? Amazing. The the next thing that you need to do for your dog is you need to be able to make a hat for them. Out of a, out of a, out of a pumpkin. Is this a cool coin? Whoa. FH78. What? Well, who am I to complain about a string of, of like words when my words are all... Hey! I'm with my friends! You are so... You are so a friend! I've got to go cry. No way! <laughs> I've got to go cry. The Evil Manor. Can you solve the mysteries of the Evil Manor? Before entering, please note, please take notes of the following. Progress is not synced between players. Unlocking a door will not unlock it for others. It's more fun to solve puzzles with, with friends. Use one of the following codes to enter the manor. For family friendly manor 6660, for blood and spooky ambiance 6663, uh, for blood and jump scares, use 6666. There's, there's no way it's scary. I know my heart rate's high, but it's just primed because of, you know, belief. The crystal ball. If you lose your way, you can trade a coin for guidance. What do I look like, huh? Scrub? Hey! I'm so scared. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna poop? There should be a poop. I'm gonna disappear. Triangle. Ah! <laughs> oh fuck, it is scary. Oh god, it is scary. Oh god. I found the chest at the manor. It seems to have the magical property of returning any lost item to me after closing and reopening it. It will surely uh, come in handy as I delve deep into the mystery of this kid's place. I already found a code to the first safe, but with a code like that, well, I doubt they really care about security around here. So first safe has a code that's like 0000. zero, zero, zero. Like... Got it. One, two, three, four. Triangle key. We go inside here. What is inside that room? That scared me. That thing actually scares me. Like I, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna scream. I'm a screamer. Place object. What? Oh. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. POV, you, you enter the mansion of the Riddler? Riddle me this, Batman. <laughs> Can you solve my six piece puzzle? Six pieces. Riddler, I see eight. I guess you won't be able to. No. Um. Uh, hmm. no, it's one of these. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, thank God it's not the sliding puzzle. The sliding ones are the, are the ones that I can't do. Those are the ones that make me irrationally angry. Not because they're bad, but because I'm bad. Uh, sure. Uh, sure. Oh, okay. And then a oh, little ear. Uh huh. I failed. I failed. There has to be a missing piece. There has to be a, a missing piece somewhere. Right? 
Oh no, not again. Oh no. There has to be a missing piece somewhere. See, that's the pumpkin. That's the pumpkin. That's the pumpkin. That's the meme. That's the thing I was telling you about, chat. That's the thing that won the contest at their office. Always run the mill pumpkin. Sorry. What did, what did you say? Look at that. I'm looking for the forbidden world. Oh, that's what you meant by look at that. Sorry. <laughs> I just <laughs> hey, no spoilers. How do I say no spoilers? I want to solve this myself. We'll figure it out. I'm a genius. This doesn't look right. These are at the top. These are 100% at the top. The cat is just misplaced. The cat needs to be further down. Or in the middle. No. What? Well, okay, solve the ones I know for sure. Okay, now this guy is misplaced. Right? Yeah. So this is in the corner, actually. And then... Oh, God. This is at top. Here we go. Here we go. And then, okay, and then we gotta, okay, just put that, okay, just put that there, okay, and then we gotta, okay, just put that there, okay, this is, <laughs> the puzzles, I'm freaking out, I'm not gonna make it. You have to be a particularly sick individual to force someone to solve a puzzle to leave, right? 489625351. 489 Four eight nine six two one one two three four five six seven. Oh oops, sorry. So it's four eight nine six two seven. Four eight nine six two seven. Three five one. The most devilish of all puzzles could be um imagine the puzzle where you can't where you don't have any corner pieces. That, I think, is a deadly puzzle. <laughs> That'd be a great Saw movie, actually. It's just two hours of solving a puzzle that has no corner pieces. There's no corner pieces in this puzzle. You must solve this, or you'll never escape. It's like a two-hour like movie. It's, it's just that one room. The moon symbol, it's locked. Hmm. There's a moon symbol, it's locked. The top of the thing is invisible. Uh, hey, this place continues to confound. It leaves me exhausted. I dozed off a bit here and fell into a horrible dream. I saw a monster with four horse heads sewn together. I can't help but feel... This is a bad omen. This is a bad omen. Uh, sure. Sewn together. We'll get some coins. I do want to collect the coins too. They feel fun to uh, let. You are so scary. I, I, I was slightly afraid. <laughs> I won't lie. They're sewn together. Remember, how do you sew these together? What is, what's that thing again? Cross stitching? Sewn together. Sewn together. There's a pattern. They feel sewn together. There's a pattern. Sewn together. Sewn together. Sewn together. I feel small. Sewn together. Sewn together. Sewn together. Like a pattern. Sewn together. Hey, it's a pig. It's kind of, it's kind of cute, actually. Sewn together. Sewn together. I'll figure this out. I will figure this out. Sewn together. Sewn together. What does it mean to be sewn together? Oh, it's a door. What does it mean to be sewn together? What does it mean to be sewn together? You know what? Lock myself in this room. 
when I lock myself in, it feels more real. Sewn together. Sewn together. Sewn together. Oh! <laughs> Sewn. Uh, south, east, west, north. So, south, east, west, north. Hey, cool. Tree. Oops. Oh, right. Tree key. Okay, well, I'll, I'll use that later. What's triangle? I love... I love... I love my cat. I love my cat. I'm the alpha. I'm the leader. I'm the one to trust. Awoo. We own the night. Dubiously agreeable. That's funny. Hello? Oh, hey. Saved photo. You don't have to, like, see a screenshot, do you? Oh, you do. Holy shit. Look. 6648. How many other photos can I take of this place? Like, how, how often is that effect used? 6648. That's cool. This is actually a very cool puzzle. Like, like basically, this whole room is cool. They... It, 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 it makes best the use of its very limited control scheme to do something cool with it. That, that's fascinating. Because you wouldn't think the like, photo mode would be used for anything and you think you'd just be doing things. But no, it's actually, it's a compelling experience. Surprisingly good. It's good. It's actually a very solid look. Look. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Why do I hear someone walking? There's a hidden door here. Which think this thing should open. But I need something to put inside. Okay, just don't freak out. Just don't freak out. I got the key. And these things need offerings. And there's a thing up there that we can go to. The treasure inside, guarded by, guarded by three fiercer monsters. Defeat them and the prize shall be yours. Defeat them. That is absolutely terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Ah! <laughs> Jesus. You're... You are so scary. You are so... Scary. You spooked me. The problem is that we're all ghosts. It's always scary here. It's always scary. Excuse me? There should be two keys. Oh no, did I open that door? I did. Alright, well, I've got a forest key. Uh, hey! Oh. It's one of them spectrograms. Let's play volleyball sometime. Yes way. I might. I might think. Hey, where's my dog? Oh, my dog. My dog disappeared. Oh, it doesn't follow you. Uh. Good residence, I guess. Oh. This reminds me of those puzzles that I made for children where it's like, what shape goes into what hole? And then, but the way that I'm going to solve it is the equivalent of the person putting everything into the square hole. Oh, it's the number of shape. It's the number of sides. Number of sides, right? How many sides does a circle have? And how many sides does a circle have that's over an oval? Uh, hmm. Is that a uterus? Um, hmm. Um, hmm. Um, hmm. Or it's it's the little look. look it, see that? Hey, look, 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 look. Some of these have a different shape on the on the laser. 
Something go wild. Yeah, something go really wild. One stronger. I'm lost. You are so... You... Do you want to Do you want to think? <laughs> POV, you say over the intercom. You're like, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. And then Saw goes, you want to think? It's like, jeez, man. All right, cool. Y'all yeah, think. Sorry for bothering you, Saw. It's minor. Oh, it's... You hear about the noises. Hey, also by the noises. That's... This is a very accessible puzzle, too. I'm actually very, very impressed. Very impressed. Very accessible puzzle. Oh, no. It's it's one it's it's like the four different ways, right? Isn't there there's probably four different ways that you that you that you that you can arrange this. So shapes wasn't one wasn't wasn't one of them. Maybe you can do the opposite. What? Maybe this shapes. Size of circle, size of ball. But this shapes last time, it didn't really matter. Hmm. We'll come back to that one. We'll come back to that one. Okay, we'll come back to that room. I refuse to use the coin. Coin. Is a. Uh, coin is a. Uh, coin is a. Uh, coin is for those who have no. Who cannot think anymore. I may have lost my body, but I still have my brain. Hello. Hey. Katoni. <laughs> it's Katoni. <laughs> it's Katoni. Oh! Chess rules. Uh, bishop. Pawn. Queen. I don't know what... King. Knight. Rook. Bishop, pawn, king, queen, knight, rook. Wait, bishop, pawn. Queen. King. Knight, rook. Bishop, pawn, queen, king. So, bishop. Is it... I can't... I have, I have memory issues. <laughs> I have memory issues. You know what? I need to exercise my memory. If I keep using te technology, it's what uh, uh, Socrates said, right? He's like, oh, books are going to ruin the oral tradition of talking. I, I need to remember. Don't write this down. It's bishop, pawn, queen, king, knight, rook. Bishop, pawn, queen, king, knight, rook. Okay, now we need to associate this with numbers. So bishop, eight, no, wait, sorry, bishop, bishop is seven, pawn, bishop, pawn, queen, king, knight, rook, seven, eight, queen, king, seven, eight, five, three, two, one, seven, eight, five, three, two, one, seven, eight, five, three, two, one, okay. <laughs> I'm a genius. Hey, we can go outside now. Cool. We need to defeat the demons somehow. Don't really know how, but you know what's sad about this? These pumpkins, right? Like these, 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 these beautifully made pumpkins. Will they be appreciated for what they are, or will they be appreciated? You are so 
ram- you are so rambunctious. <laughs> or will they be appreciated? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just don't scare. You are so scary. You are so scary. Stop popping out of nowhere. <laughs> Jesus, you scared me. Eek. Babby. What? Go away. Oh, I thought that said gay for a second. I was like, what? The baby gay? Six 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 five five two one. Like for instance this. Do you rate the pumpkin because it's a, it's a good pumpkin? Or do you rate the pumpkin because you've made it? Right? Is there a dog? Oh my god, that's such a cute little dog. Look at the dog. Look at that dog. That's a good dog. I'm gonna read it because I like it. Deep the baby? Baddie. <laughs> okay, what's this? Hey scissors! Why do I need scissors? Scissors? For the basement, I get you. I, I I I guarantee you for the basement. Get this. Tie. Rock paper scissors. Rock. Paper scissor. Lose. Okay. Well. Rock. Paper scissors. So rock scissor paper. Yeah. Okay. So this. 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 This, 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 this. All right, now we go horse. I have too many keys. Not again. Okay, it, it didn't get me this time because I was I was aware of it. Okay, let's see. We gotta go to the moon room. Hello. Hey, what's this? Hey! You can leave. Saw. So, though you may have made these games to terrorize people, you forgot one thing. They can just jump. After exploring the secret room behind the office, I thought I'd take a moment to rest here. I'm quite hungry. I hope I find some more of those mushrooms. So let this orienting to shrink and grow with each bite, but it's well worth the flavor. Decide to leave my spare notepad here to light my pack. I sure no one, no one ta hopes takes it while I'm gone. Secret room behind the office. What office? There's an office? Where's the office? It looks scratch marks. One, two, three, four. Or it's a it's an index. Or it's an in, it's an in, it's an. <sighs> I'm gonna stop talking. There's no point talking. There's no point talking. There's no point talking. Where's the office? What office? What office? Kitchen. That's eyeball. Hmm. Kitchen. Office? Not. Office. What office? Bedroom. Bedroom. Both are bedrooms. But the kids room so office behind the office you hear that see that i knew your secret sunny gym oh my god Wait. I recognize those teeth. Where'd you go? Where'd that thing go? Oh my god. I'm getting out of here. Uh, we'll do that last. <laughs> uh, it's kind of scary. Let's see what it says. These numbers all have something in common. They all equal to 10. Something doesn't add up, or does it? The squares represent missing digits. Bonus hint. What do they look like, huh? 
these numbers all have something in common. They all equal 10, something doesn't add up, or is it, or it does it? It's a missing digit. These numbers all have something in common. They're a multiple of one of these numbers. 19 is a multiple of 1. 73 is a multiple of 1. 28 is a multiple of 1. 82 is a multiple of 1. 37 is a multiple of 1. 55 is a multiple of 1. 91 is a multiple of 1. Easy. Easy. So easy. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. So those are multiples of 9. Where's my friend? I need my friend. I... My friend. Where's the friend? Are they stuck somewhere? Hello, friend? You stuck? Where are they? I, I need to look at them. Every time I've looked at them, I've... I felt better. Wait a minute. Plus? Circle? Wait a minute, see that? When you leave a room and you come back, you feel like you see, you're seeing things again. Color! There's another pattern of color. Color, color, color. Wait, what the fuck? Where'd you come from? <laughs> Sorry. You are so scary. How did you get inside there? What the fuck? The pattern of color over here, and it's a pattern of this stuff. There's patterns all around the room that correspond to this stuff. Okay, I'll, I'll do it last. Uh, what'd you say? Ooh, I I don't keep saying that I'll do it last, but sometimes it's good to step away to think about this. I mean, so there's one set of numbers that's a multiple of nine, right? Because nine times eight is seventy-three, and eighty-two, then ninety-one. Wait. So it's one, two, three. So nine, thirty-nine. So thirty-nine. So one, two, three, five, and five. I think it's interesting. One and nine. The four. The four is the one I'm curious about. Four. Seven, seven, four, seven, five, five, one, nine, three, nine, four, seven. So five, 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 four, seven. Eh? Oh, fifty-five. But fifty-five plus forty-seven plus fifty-five plus fifty-five plus forty-seven plus. 30. Plus, 30 plus 39 plus 9 150 I don't know if that's true <laughs> okay well this is it this is my moment I want you to know it took me two days to solve the gas station puzzle it's Hill. it took me two days we might be stuck here for a very long time. And I refuse to use the bonus hints because it says if I use the bonus hints, then it know then I know that I'm bad. I I need to whiteboard this. I I need to whiteboard this. We 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 I need to whiteboard this. We're 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 gonna whiteboard this. We're gonna whiteboard this. Why what why is it why is there a, why is there a yellow out, outline on the game? What's this? How do I stop that? Why is there a yellow outline? What the hell? Okay, now it's gone. We need to whiteboard this.
Uh. Sure, we'll just use this. Yeah, sure. Okay, we'll see. Uh, everything. No, everything. Okay, okay, good. Whoa, okay, let's go. Full screen this? All right. Copy paste this in. All right, here we go. Now we're now we're really cooking. You can't see it yet, but you will see it soon. You have technology for a reason. I refuse to be beaten by it. by numbers. Humanity made math to wield as as a scientific tool. Therefore, we must solve this. Otherwise, I'm going to go crazy. Okay, so we need to wipe with this. So here. You can see these numbers are multiples. So 73 equals 9 times 8, right? 9 times... <laughs> it's been a long time. Listen, I don't... I don't use math on a daily basis. I should, but I don't. Am I the reason why the, like, education is not respected the way it should be because I'm like a failed product of, this, uh, of the system. I'll, I'll think about this as I pee. I have the answer. The reason why I can't solve this is because uh, I'm really bad at math. Um, let's figure out what this is. So yeah, nine times. Wait, I'm stupid. <laughs> wait, nine times 10, it's 90. Wait, 81. Yeah, wait, what? I'm stupid. <laughs> wait a minute. Uh, 54, 45, 54, 63, 72. Yeah, I'm stupid. <laughs> oh, no, I am stupid. <laughs> I am stupid. Oh, God. Wait, so what is that? What is that number? Maybe it's just the number of occurrences, but then it's weird because it's like eight and seven aren't really a part of anything, right? So it's like, it's not, it's not about nine. It's not about nines. That, that, sorry, that, that's, so, that's so dumb of me. But 19, like this? You can correlate this to this, right? Oh, they all equal 10? Something it doesn't add up, or does it? So maybe, like, 7 and 3 equals the thing. 1 and 9 equals the thing. 2 and 8? There's no 2, so we don't care about that. Maybe we don't care about some of these numbers. 5 and 5? No, but then I'm just doing the same thing over here, too. And then there's no six. So what's the difference between me and this? Nothing. So may, may, maybe there's a, maybe there's a different way. Okay, we be a new color. Okay, so may, maybe there's a different way. Maybe we can do like a. I don't know. These numbers are all something in common. What do they have in common? I don't know. But well, 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 what are the commonalities? Right. This. Okay. Hey, don't don't you dare fill ever again. No. Don't don't fill shit. Transparent. Thank you. This are connected. This and this are connected. 19 and 91 are connected. The 55 is the odd one out. Right? This is the one that makes you go like, what is going on? See, so everything has a pair, but not the 55. The 55 is a repeat of itself, but it also has no pair in these two pairings numbers. There's a missing number pair. It's because backwards, it's the same thing. It's just five, five. So wait, is the answer literally just what number makes these add up to, to 10? Is, is that the actual answer? <laughs> Did I overcomplicate this? <laughs> Do I have a complicate this? Like, am I stupid? Five, six, seven. I can't believe it! Fuck! There's a, there's a thing that I've learned from thinking about it more and more, and I realized that if a puzzle game has, like, too many... It's like, you don't, even, you don't need to include red herrings. You know what I mean? Like, you don't even need to in, in include more than the basics. Your players will do a good job of confusing themselves. Can I make this look cooler, actually? Alternate universe? What the hell does that mean?
don't know. What is what is small? Okay, this one we know for sure it's about the horses. The horses play a major role. And by the way, the emotes, the um, the weird emotes where my teeth are showing in my character, it comes from the same stock image of this horse, or at least uh, it's a very similar one. The teeth in that picture is because of that horse. Eight eyes. Are there eight eyes? I don't really know if there are eight eyes. To each. The hard part is how do, you, how do you count them? It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is a very disorienting effect, but it's such a good effect. I'm not saying that it's bad. I'm saying it's perfect. Remind it's 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 quite literally what you it's Oh, wait a minute. How many horses are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh. Pause. <laughs> Eight. Six. Six, eight, four, six. Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ, you are so scary! Eek! You, <laughs> Jesus Christ! Four, six, six, eight, six, four, six. Thank you for giving me the, the jump scare of a lifetime. Jesus Christ, you scared me. Alright, let's go. Wait, uh, what was the room that I had, I had to do? There's still one more room, right? It was a color room. The patterns room. Okay, so there's multiple patterns. I have one pattern, which is the, the, the noise. There's another pattern here. From top to bottom. How many greens is there place? One, two, three, four... See, if you divide it into six squares. There's two yellows. It's one, two. Yellow is two. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe it's only bottles. One, two, three, four, five, six greens. So this is uh, on number six. I don't know what that could be. Look at that show off. They really solved it. They're a genius. Purple. Five is blue. Purple. Uh, you can't fool me anymore. I'm not afraid of you anymore. I'm over you. Wait, but this. Wait, no, but there's also six blue. Or six purple. Wait, but then the purple also has orange. Oh, so maybe three orange, but then there's three purple. Oh, wait, that's spread around everywhere. Wait, 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 wait. Ha? Huh? Good. Uh, put them here for posterity. This, this, is, this is for later. This is all for later. This is all for later. What? It's not a real tub? Rub a dub dub, get in my tub, it doesn't work? Wow. That's unfortunate. What, uh. Okay, wait, so what. Okay, how many of these are? One, two, three, four, fi five, six, seven. Okay, how do, I, how do I deal with this? Seven. Seven? Okay, let's just do bottles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six bottles. Six green bottles. So if there's seven of those, then that's wrong. Or is it right? Maybe we, we only care about what's outside the cabinet. 
Well, I'll do this later. <laughs> we'll do it later. We'll uh, we'll solve the exorcism downstairs. We have the hand. Where's the hand? Oh no! Oh no! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Oh no! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Okay. Well, that that's fine. Uh, where's the basement? Where's the basement? What are you? Oh, the hand. What are you for the hand? I feel the hand. It's oh, they left. Oh! Rock, paper, scissor. Uh. It's hard to figure out the rules. But I think paper. The X is scissor, right? This is not paper. This is paper. The circle is a rock. Because rocks are circular. Paper is man-made and thus devoid of any natural curves. Um, therefore, it's rock. Is a chest here? Oh my god. Thank you. You're, you've been defeated. Oh, defeat them. Sorry. Need to defeat them. Right. Right. Kill you. Kill you. Kill you. Get, uh, what's this key? What? Cool. Wait, there's now toy section. Benjamin, Delilah, Charlotte. From what I know, there should be a clue in this graveyard to give me access to the red safe. I can't seem to figure it out. Perhaps I don't have all the information I need yet. I should come back later when I made more progress elsewhere. What? Okay, that's a cool pumpkin. Respectably hushed pumpkin. It must be these marks on the trees. Right? Maybe it's not. Hmm. Hmm. In case you forgot the code to the shed. Check the blue page. It's stored safe and sound in the basement. He's got the f in case you forgot the things the shed. Oh, you're a five one three. Hey, hello there, pain. Amelia. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Amelia Paint. Amelia Paint. Amelie. Amelia Rates. If I ever meet an Amelia in my life, I'm I'm gonna call them Amelia Rate. In the bottom. Why'd you move? Why'd the hand move? The hand moves. What? That opens that. Okay. I'll, I'll come back to this later. <laughs> I'm glad this. Uh Escape room has a lot of different options for you to do because it's like if you get stuck in one, you can come back elsewhere. The problem is, I don't have the uh, chest here, so I need to walk them all back. Oh. Like, what What are you? What, what is the solution to this? Are you here? Ooh. I should eat a mushroom to be smaller. I'm assuming it's important because one of these things did mention getting smaller. But I don't want to get smaller. Yet. But maybe I should. Because that note outside told me to. And it should be important. 
eat the mushrooms to get smaller. It just doesn't feel real that one of the solutions is I have to leave and come back. Feels wrong. But maybe that is a, a, a solution. It's, it's to be small. You know what? Yeah, let's try it. Let's hope it saves progress. Hello, chat. How are you? We're solving some haunted mystery stuff here. Some spooky pumpkins. That's kind of cute. I bet I can jump down the well. Also, because this lets you fly. And it does feel kind of broken. Because couldn't you theoretically start from here, even? Oh, I guess this is... Oh, it's like a whole different thing. You could just go to the backyard. Hmm. Maybe, maybe you're not supposed to be small. <laughs> maybe being small is not a part of the solution. Can I call salad a salad if it doesn't have a dressing? What's the what's the context? Ah. Why am I flying? Oh, you know. It's just one of my it's one of my many powers. Did everything reset? No, right? I still have the hand. Oh, thank God. Okay, good. I still have the hand. Uh. Oh wait, the kids, the kids' rooms. The rooms upstairs, so it's it's their rooms. Figure out when they were born and stuff. I need to redo this. So waveform. Again, very accessible puzzle. I like it. Now here is where I'm lost. How many reds are there? There's two reds. We, d we go by deduction. So we go by the ones that we have. We have two red cans. So number two. How many yellows? We have no... We have one... Two... Three yellow. There's a coin. We have three yellow. So yellow is number three. How many, how many, how many oranges? How many oranges? Orange is a very particular color. Oranges are on these things. So whatever I can see is orange. One, two, three. I can't see orange on this. So orange is number three. But that's yellow. Do you count the pumpkin? Would you look at this with the, with the, with the third eye? The eye, the eye of providence is in the head. How many oranges are there? Is that the orange? Wait. Let's say I'm colorblind. How could you solve this if you were colorblind? Because that's the easier way of doing it. I don't, I don't think I can do this if I'm not colorblind. I'm going to be honest with you. A little small. Hey, how'd you get small? What the? Where'd you get the mushrooms? I think you count the pumpkin. So in which case, orange is four. You think I'm small? I... You... Are... So... Silly. You're so silly. You order the salad and it ain't got no dressing. What, uh... Well, what, 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 what flavor was it supposed to be? You're so silly. <laughs> How'd you get small? What's your secret, huh? Where's the shrooms? Wait, wait maybe there's a... Wh where? I need more underscores. I'm gonna... Mushroom? I'm gonna... I'm gonna die. What a blue. Let's just find blue. Is that blue or is that purple? Would I consider that blue or would I consider that purple? I know it's a different shade, but like, what is blue? 
I might breathe. <laughs> so true. Look, six boards. Why? Why are there six boards? One, two, three, four, five, six. Named after a hockey player. I'm not even going to bother trying to solve that. I'm in the middle of a puzzle. Wow, that's also my favorite flavor. Blood. Pumpkin. Uh, I'm going to do this. There's four ways to solve this. Four. Really? Four? Like, what? What am I missing? Four ways to solve this. What am I missing? Four configurations. I tried complex shape to simple shape. Doesn't really work. All the all the bits and pieces need to be present to solve it. Do I talk to the crystal ball? I really don't want to talk to the crystal ball. But we're gonna be stuck here for like three hours if, if I don't. Because there's also okay. You know what? I know where to get the ages of the people. So let's just do that first. It's Amelia. Who who, who died? Charlotte, Benjamin, Delilah, Amelia. Charlotte, Benjamin, Delilah, Amelia. Amelia, Benjamin, Charlotte, Delilah. A, B, C, D. Why did you think that I was good at puzzles? It, it's You think I'm good at puzzles because I'm better than you. I want to be beautiful. <laughs> you are so beautiful. A, B, C, D. Doubt. Well, you know what? Do you know why I don't doubt your intelligence? Because I'm not an asshole. Because only people who are assholes would come in to make fun of someone. I just did. I know. In response to what? In response to who? What, what did you just say? You always come in, and you always say the darndest things, and you wonder why I say it. You know what I mean? It's like... You, you kind of place it on yourself, chat. Oh, I guess the years these kids. A B A B I I don't know what C is. I think this dog likes me. <laughs> you are so silly. A B is there no maybe there's no C? I thought it was maybe the the cubes, but the problem is I can't find the mapping for C. A B C D. Hmm. Amelia, Delilah, Charlotte. I guess too. It's like how do you know which? Oh wait. Dog photo. No photo. Three photo. Maybe they're dead. I mean, they are dead. So maybe, like, why would dead people have rooms? Amelia, Delilah, Charlotte. 
Benjamin. I'm falling for that again. Amelia Benjamin. Charlotte Delilah. Amelia Charlotte. Benjamin Delilah. I never got that key, door key. I got this one. I got this one. I got this one. Maybe I do use the hint. Maybe I need to use the hint. Mushroom. Shrink and grow. I decided to leave my spare notepad. Maybe you should have said I thought you were good at puzzles. Well, I think either way, it still sounds like one of those things that's like, what's the point of saying it? Not to say that like you need to be always positive, but like, I give as much as I get. And it's like, no matter how you say it, you're sort of pressing doubts on how good my skills are. And so if, if you feel hurt that I'm making a joke back at you, then I'm going to also make a joke back at you. You take everything I say negatively because chat, I want you to read what you wrote. I thought you were good at puzzles. Even if it's a joke, even if it's a joke, it still is kind of mean. So I'm going to have to respond back in kind. Like, I don't understand. My problem, see, you know what your problem is? If you give me a statement like that, there's only one way that I can take it, and that's I have to jest back with a little bit of a mean attitude. If I can't jest back with a little bit of a mean attitude, then, you know, it, maybe it means that what, you're, what you said was never meant to be funny. Like, uh, I'm sorry, like... So wait, so you're allowed to say it like that to me, but I can't say it like that back at you, right? Like, I can't make a joke like, it's because I'm better than you at puzzles? It's like, wait a minute. And then saying, like, the whole doubt thing, it's like, well, yeah, but I don't doubt you, you know what I mean? I can't do that? I can't do that, but you could do it. I want you to really read what you said. I want you to really read what you said. And it's like, I'm not making the wrong joke here. If you feel like I'm making the wrong joke, then it's fine, right? And I'm not saying that your joke is bad. I'm just saying that, like, it gets in churn. The joke gets in churn the same type of joke. I don't mind it, but it means that we're going to have the same types of jokes flying back and forth, right? I think you're great at puzzles, honey. Now that is condescending. You sound like how my mother used to when she still talked to me. You know what I mean? Like... You keep, like, am I not allowed to poke fun back at you if you're going to poke, poke a fun at me? I don't get it. So I think I'm justified in poking fun back at you. Using the same energy. Same energy. At least my mom compliments me, chat. He likes my puzzles. I can't see anything that would change my opinion of that blue, red, green, whatever shape puzzle. All right. You like my suit. Thank you. I like your face. It has to be this, but then there's like nine of these. So what do I do? Do I do math? Oh, <gasps> wait. It's the shape. But then it's still the, uh, like, even if it's a shape. Okay, so it's a color. So color and then shape. But then, no, that doesn't make any sense. There's some colors that are unaccounted for. Like, blue. Because blue and purple are way too close to each other for this. There's red as a circle. Plus? But then there's a red plus? There's a red plus? Did you know apparently the red cross thing? You're not supposed to use a, a red cross in the games. It's like very, very heavy about not being used for some reason. And the reason is apparently because if you use it, and you use it in a game poorly, or if you use it in a game at all, and they do something that's like bad or, or something, it sort of uh, devalues the meaning of it in like a real world worst, worst situation. Not that this is that problem, but. Look, I'm just saying, my joke was the same vibe as yours. 
And I, I give the same joke to every chatter, like how I just said to that chatter, I, I like their face. So I'm just saying, if you can't take it, then why dish it? Yeah, that's the first one. And that was based on the radio wave, as well as the sound. Wait a minute, that was only based on sound. That was only based on sound. Is that the same as the radio wave? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's the same. So it's the same as the radio waves, or like the spectral waves. The sound is the same as that, so they're both, the, so they're, so they're both equivalent. So it has to be these things. Okay, maybe I don't look at the ones in the cabinet. Don't look at the cabinet. It's not worth it. Look around the room. One, red. Two, three, red. But where is green? Where is where is pink? Where is pink? Where is pink? See, like, the pink is the one that's throwing me off. Number of boards? I don't know. I'm 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 using hints. You should be you should try solving the puzzle in the creepy lab next. The gem puzzle. What? Each gem is a bit different than the be put in order. There are a few different ways to order these gems. Can you find all four of them? Notice the oscilloscope, perhaps you can use to sort the gems. You need to sort the gems by color, size, the number of sides, and picture the sounds. Well, I did the I did the number of sides. It didn't work. What do you mean? I did, I, I did the, the oh, do you know what? This isn't a circle. <laughs> I thought this was a circle. My bad. Okay, now the answer is obvious. I thought this was a circle. Sorry. You see, streamer, the problem is that you can't count. That's a, that, that's really step number one. Excuse it? Okay, now that... See, now it makes sense. So I was on the right track. I just didn't know my shapes between my shapes. I was just I was just wrong. And then I guess frequency. So now I need to do it by frequency. So sound is different from frequency. What? I need to see what what shape this is. It's very light. That's heavier than this. That's is that heavier or is this heavier? That's weaker. This is stronger. This is like dead. This thing is basically on. I swear I just end up with the exact same thing as last time. I didn't read the hint fully because I was trying to avoid the answer to the hint. But I'm going to do it. So we did shape. Color. Color? You just sort the gems by color? Size. The number of sides and the pitch of their sound. Oh, so the oscilloscope is literally the sound. Okay, cool. So color? Anyways, all I'm saying is, right? I give as much as I get. If people are sarcastic, I give sarcastic. If you're coming in with like, you know, a very sarcastic sort of like jokey thing that still like deprecates someone, I'm going to do the same thing back to you. And if you don't like it, you got to stop doing it then. I don't know what I don't know what to do. I feel like everyone here is like so like annoyed by my responses, but I'm like, dude, like you give me a deprecating response that, like, downplays my skills. It's like, that's funny. And I'll do it back to you. Because, like, that's the whole point of this. 
If I can't have fun with you, then you can't have fun with, with me. And do you really want that? No. So it's important. It's important that I'm allowed to do it back to you. And I'm going to point it out. Like, I'm going to be like, yeah, like, you, it's what it sounds like. Because honestly, that sentence really does sound like that, right? It's like saying, I thought that you were good at puzzles in the context of someone failing puzzles sounds exactly like what you think it is, which is, I doubt that you're actually good. And it's like, that's a good one. Like, I like that. That's fine. But I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to throw it back at you, right? Exactly. It's like saying, your voice makes me think that you're very handsome. Same thing. Your typing makes me think that you passed at least grade one. <laughs> it's the same thing. If I'm not allowed to do that, then, you know, you got to think about how to word your phrases better. I did. Thank you for noticing. See? I don't even know what the color is here. What could possibly be the color? There's red, green, blue. Red. Green. Blue. And then just uh, extra. Red RGB. Wait. CMK? Something magenta something. Was it CMYK or something? What, what are the color families? Things. RGB, RGB, but not. <laughs> color systems besides RGB. Cyan, magenta, yellow, black. Okay, that doesn't really help me. DMYK. What the fuck is the color? What are the goddamn colors? And I've noticed that about people. Like, people will just come in and they'll say things in the like chat, and then they'll be surprised that I react the way that I do. And it's like, yeah. It's like, I, I thought we were in on the same joke. Clearly not. It's one of those phrases, too, where it's like, by saying it, it's like, the only right option to say anything there, if you don't want to sound like very like sarcastically like jesting at, at like someone, is to not say it, right? Because the context and saying it at that moment makes it sound like why why would you say that, right? But I take things very lightly on stream because it's like you know it's kind of it it tend to poke fun in the back, and then people get mad at me. It's like dude, like you have a problem. I don't know how to help you, Chad. Like I genuinely don't know how to help you. You have a significant problem that, that, that stems from your own actions. And, and, and then you get annoyed when like, people react the way that they do. But it's like, what did you expect from what you wrote? I don't understand. Is that not the joke that you were going for? Maybe you should have like, thought about, how, about, about, about what you said. I don't understand. How is it that I've cultivated a chat that doesn't understand that this is going to be the back and forth? And then they say it's like, oh, it's my fault for taking it n negatively. It's like, I thought that was the vibe. Because if it wasn't meant to be like a negative jesting statement, what was it meant to say? Like, realistically, if it wasn't meant to be a negative jesting statement, which is fine. It's fine to jest with like a negative to like, you know, poke, poke a fun at me, right? What was it meant to be? I want you to really think about it. What was it meant to be? If you don't have a good answer, it's because it wasn't meant to be anything good. It could also be an ESL thing, right? But it's one of those things where it's like, if it's ESL, I'm sorry, but like, that's the way it comes off. And it's just the way that I'm going to react. It's just funny. I got to, I got to really, I have to really, you know, let, I have to, let, I, have to I have to let you know, chat. What the hell is the color? I don't have, I don't have a good color system idea. I have no clue what to, what to do about color. I might I might die <laughs> I'm gonna watch <laughs> I might cry if you watch me I might genuinely cry if, 
it, if you watch me, I have I have anxiety. Is there like I feel or like I want to be? I want to be. I want to be. I want to be. I want to be creepy. Look at that color. I know it's. I, I I know about the color. I don't know how to solve the color. It's not the color. It's. I I, I don't know what the color means. <laughs> Look at that, the color. Oh God, they're making fun of me. I know about the color. I know about the color. I don't get the colors. I don't know. I don't know colors. My brain is nice and smooth. My brain is nice and smooth. I don't know about the colors. I don't understand color systems. I don't get color systems. I don't get it. Like, what do you mean, sort by color? You know what I mean? The reason why I program is because I can't think about colors. You tell me to sort by color, it's like, honey, the green and the orange, I don't think these two overlap. <laughs> I don't know which one's better or worse. I don't know. This pumpkin is red. No, no, no. Don't give me the answer. Don't, don't, don't give me the answer. Get out of here. I want to be think. I... Might be think. I, I might think. Don't, don't, don't give the answer. I'll, I'm not saying it, you. I'm not saying it, though. I refuse to, to say them. They're saying lies. They're saying answers. I know it's the color. I just can't solve the color. I'm gonna, just, just let me think. And just, just let me think about this. I refuse to I refuse to look. Okay, these feel like the same color. You know what I mean? Like these feel like the same color? These feel like the same color. It's it's the aura. There's an aura to this. What's that what's that thing? Tertiary colors? I, I need a color wheel. A color, color, the color theory wheel. Oh my god, yes. Yes! <laughs> I need to I need to lay this out in a circle. That's the only way that I'm going to solve this. I need to lay it out in a circle. It's like a it's like a seance circle. It's like a candle circle, but not really not not really really the same. Okay, now which one's first? <laughs> okay, if we go from top to bottom. Is this, is this, do people know this? People know this, Pe people know this, like naturally? Like how do you know purple is made from these two colors? And how do you know that orange is in between red and green? Is that how color works in real life? Oh, my niece has a bunch of paint that she left. So maybe, maybe I can take the paint. I should have just, I should have pulled out the paint. If I pulled out the paint, I, I would have known the answer. Okay, let's assume reds first, because it's at the top in the image of the color wheel theory. Uh, yeah, blue is next after green. I refuse to listen to this ghost. This ghost is a bit too spoilery. This ghost is no longer my friend. Not this again. <laughs> oh god, not this again. Oh god, oh god, not this again. Oh, not this again, to add up to 10. Oh, okay, okay, I was like, oh god. So it's four. Two, z zero, eight. Oh, I need a, I need to take an online class. I need to actually go and like learn the color system. My problem is I don't understand how it works. Uh, I just don't understand colors and like light. 
Okay, so now to open this, we need all the dates of the people who died. Very important. We need to know when they died. Tick tock, it's on the clock. Uh. I'm also gonna need to find the clock again. <laughs> it's been a long time since I said the one. Oh, look! An alternate realm. Can you break the mirror? Can I throw something inside there to break the mirror? I kind of want to break the mirror. Is there anything that's uh, throwable? I know what's throwable. If this thing doesn't cause... Oh, wait, no, no, no. Actually, this is wrong. I've learned this. When you're in a car, you want something... No, but... The, right? So, in a car... Let's say you're stuck on the water. You want something that'll free you from under the water, right? So, you take the thing that has, like, the sharpest edge. Which is one of those, like, car door window openings, right? So, you pop that out, and you use it to pop open the, like, car door. Um, but... Why use a triangle, or, like, a single point, when you use a shape that has a ton of points? Same concept, but now you have more options. More chances to get it right. You can't throw in this game. <laughs> you can't throw in this game, can you? Okay, well, that was a, dis uh, a, a disaster. Um, we'll do it later. Up, left, up, right. Up, right, up, left. Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. Symbols on the things. Tick tock. Where was there a clock? There's three clocks on each floor. So the time on each floor, but there's only three clocks here. And the time here, the time on this thing is between 1, 3, 6, 9, 12. Yeah, so it's, be it, it's between, it's like a 3. No, it, it's like a 2. 2 p.m., 2 p.m., 2 p.m., or 2, 2, 2. I guess 2 or 3 p.m. doesn't really, 2, 2 p.m. or 2 a.m. So tick tock, maybe it's every other, other clock. How, how many clocks were there? more clocks and the red safe is one is the one with the uh, dead kids hmm. so 12 9 10 10 10 10 12 Ooh. 10, 12. I, somebody snapped the photo of me. I think they're onto me. I may have to leave soon. I, I, I think they're onto me. 10, 12. So that's one. Is that the one on the ground floor? That's one on the ground floor. So second floor should have a clock too. Hmm. I remember seeing a clock somewhere. Where was it? So. Is it, maybe it's only the hour hand. Wait, no, but they, okay, go back to the drawing. <laughs> Which was the hand that, like, mattered? There's one hand that mattered over the, over the other. Was it the short hand or the long hand? Short hand is the hour. The short hand, so it's the hour. Okay, so 10, first floor 10. What? First floor 10, second floor... 7. 10, 7, third floor is, uh, 10, 7, where's the third floor? 10, 7, 10, BRB, I hate spam calls, 10, 7, 10, 7, did I solve it? everything here? I did, 10, 7. Where is the third floor? What? Ten seven. Ten seven. 
Was I not just on the third floor? What happened? Maybe that's the third floor. Ten seven. No, but this is. You are so. You are so clever. <laughs> Something that's rude. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's funny. I can imagine what the first word was. Where's the third floor? What? Third floor. Third floor. Is this the third floor? <laughs> How many floors in this house are there? See, this is what happens. Why be rich when there's too many floors? Be poor and have only two floors. Even one floor. Oh. Basement. So 10 is second floor. 7 is top floor. Basement is 7. So 7. Basement. 7, 10, 7. Right? Seven? Yeah, seven, ten, seven. Seven, ten, seven. It's not, it's not first floor. This is a poor house. Only rich houses have a first floor. Seven, ten, seven. Right, because it, it's literally the point of the drawing. <laughs> huh? Huh. Aha. Well, what do you know? I want to figure out this thing. You know what I mean? Like, there's a whole alternate world here. I need to, I, I, I need to figure out how to be small. I can place my pumpkin? What? How do I get small? I, I guess I'll do it later, but... That, that is, how did how'd you get small? What the fuck? It's small. Where's the mushroom? I'm trying to find the mushroom since forever. Is the mushroom here? Where's the mushroom? Look, quite hungry. We'll find some more of those mushrooms. Let's start to shrink and grow with each bite. But how? I want to shrink and grow. Where's the mushroom? <laughs> where, where are the mushroom? Or is there a way to maintain my height as I enter? Would be cool. Maybe there is no mushroom. Yet. Maybe maybe there's a mushroom yet. And I'll find the mushroom later. But we'll, we'll face. So maze. Okay, well that's anticlimactic. One, two, three, four, five. Multiple codes. I see. Gotta do five. Oh, right. So, number one. What? You start from up here, and then you go here. It's one, two, three, four, five. Hello. Look at you, tiny little person. How'd you get, how'd you get the mushroom, hmm? Yo, you're, you are so small. You cute little thing, you. <sighs> the fifth number is that one. What is the goddamn relation to this? You are, you are so large. I know. <laughs> uh, he he. Right there. You are so large and you are so small. What was the point of saying that? To poke fun at the situation in a jesting manner. That's a little bit kind of like, what's the point? And a little bit disappointing. That's exactly what I'm talking about. It's that level of stuff. See, no one just gets it. Everyone's all like angry and stuff, you know? It's not my problem. I swear I've seen these symbols somewhere. Oh, wait, these symbols are for the hands downstairs, probably. Right? Yes, I think. 
I guess what I'm confused about is like what how do I correlate this? <laughs> so one top right is moon. That's the one. But you start from this. So if you start from this and you don't really care about this, as except for like a cipher, then it's five, one, two, three, four. Uh, it's so I'm wrong. You know what I mean? Like I, I So maybe it is one, two, three, four, five. But then that's stupid. <laughs> There's a reason why this looks like this. And then, you know, th this is not the same. There's a reason why. There's a reason why these symbols are shaped like that to give you a certain number. But then what does the bottom mean? <laughs> Or maybe one, two, three, four, five. So one, two, three, four, five. So five, one, two, three, four. Or do you go a different way? Five. 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 One. Three. Two. Are these three different moon shapes? I don't believe it. Why was that right? How did, how did I do that? You're confused. I'm also confused. I entered five, one, three, two, four, right? The problem is that this is one, two, three. So this is the same as one, two, three. And five is over here. So this makes sense. This is the cipher to get the numbers for down here. You enter it from left to right. And you use this to then decode the number. But the problem is the three moons. How is three before two? So it's five, one, three, two, four. How is one, three, two make any sense in this photo? I don't get that. The five makes sense because that's the first in the sequence. But then where's the one, the three, and the two? Like, how does it one, three, two, and not one, two, three, four? Unless I solved something else by accident. Did I? I did. I solved this. <laughs> Oops. I solved this one. Sorry. So that number I entered wasn't for this. I, I solved this one. Because this is five, one, two, three, four. Because this is one, two, three, four, five, right? So you do five first. Left to right, you go in a circle of, uh, so you go in a circle clockwise. So five, one, and then the next number is three. And you see here, so you go to the rightmost number, two, and then four. So I solve this one. So this one is, what? So this one, okay, I see, okay, okay. So this one should be correct. So this one should be five, one, two, three, four. What? Oh. I accident I accidentally chose the wrong one. That's why they have this. Or maybe this maze is for that room. But up left, up right, up right, up left. Up left, up I I, I still don't get it. I don't get why this one was the correct one, but that one wasn't the correct one. Or maybe they're all correct in their own way. But this should shouldn't this open up all the way? So, okay, let's, let's, let's do this one. This was easy. Five, one, three, two, four. Five, one, three, two, four. So, five, one. I don't get it. <laughs> okay, maybe I solved the wrong one by accident. So now I, I, I don't know. Why was this the answer to this room? The eye thing, the, the eyes of the statues are for something downstairs with the hands, for sure. Because the hands have to have the symbols. So what was there? How did you know which one to solve in this room? It must have been the pyramid. Oh my god, look, because the pyramid has the eye in it. Oh, I see. So it's like you choose the right one to use to solve the, the cipher. And you would see the eye and you'd be like, oh, I use the eye. And then the sun, this is not a star. This is the sun. Or maybe it is a star. 
that the intended answer? I feel like I got that wrong. <laughs> I feel right. I feel wrong despite being right. I feel wrong despite being right. Anyways, there's a more pressing there's a more pressing matter. Being small is actually important. So it's not just a funny haha -ha statement. You do need to find a mushroom. The problem is when I eat the mushroom and I come inside, I grow large again. Unless there's a button that makes you go small. Is there a button that makes you go small? Maybe? I don't know. No. Hmm. Oh. I've got my thinking cap on. So, yeah, I, I accidentally solved it. Sorry. That was a bad solution. Sorry, uh, that was a bad... It was a bad solve for me, but the puzzle was good. I just didn't recognize the signs. I should have thought about it more, because, like, everything is very, very uh, important. But I think I'm just so used to so many different props that I kind of, like, turn my, my uh, brain off. The problem now is to find a mushroom inside the house so I don't lose my size as I re-enter. It's kind of the problem now. Because I ate the mushroom outside, and I still became small after. find more of those mushrooms is what the person said could be a mushroom in the garden hmm this needs all four hands so you can't solve it here I really need to get small red safe yeah. there should be a mushroom somewhere Go to the shed. We have to go to the shed. There's no mushroom here. There's however a ladder. But no mushroom. Well, there's a, there's a mushroom over there. But it seems quite far to use a mushroom over there for this. See? Look, okay, so now I'm small. Maybe I was never small. Or maybe I still am small. I don't know. Maybe it matters which door you come in? I don't know. Okay, now I'm large. <laughs> okay, so now I'm large. <laughs> Where the hell are the mushrooms? How do you get small in this game? How do you get small in this building? <laughs> I need mushrooms. I need, I need mushrooms. Mush, I might, I might cry. Where's the mushroom? Where's the mushroom? I need the mushroom. I need a mushroom. How do people get small in this game? They get small. Small, anything small. Small, 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 small. Am I not gonna be able to get small? <laughs> small? Where's the small? Where's the mushroom? Where's the mushroom? Where's the mushroom? How do I get small in this place? How do I get small? I'm gonna be a tiny little guy. Wait. Up, left. Right, up, right, up, left. Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Okay, always repulsive pumpkin. Oh, you are so... Scary! How long were you waiting there? <laughs> okay, so we have the mushroom now. Now to read binary. <laughs> Reading binary is very cool and it's easy too. The next time you're in public, try pulling out some binary and reading it. You're bound to make some friends at the Maris. Hey, man. 
What's the number for the emergency services here? 101101. And by, by the time you're done, they've like bled out to like that. Okay. I get it. But whatever. It, it, it makes sense. Good lady. Problem is, what's what's the code to, to, to the, that thing? Oh, hey, little fella. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> Okay. What? There's supposed to be a fourth clock, but I've searched everywhere. Inside the manor, all across the festival grounds. Even in alternate universes, I just can't find it. From everything I've researched, the time on that clock is the key I need. I thought I might never be able to find the clock. Maybe the person you read is for the power to search place outside of my realm of existence. Luckily, this keypad seems optional. I'll pass on this for now. What? Realm of existence? The hell is a realm of existence? Is it this thing? No, no, don't play pumpkin. Also, the universe. Forbidden world? Wait, it looks different. There's a fourth clock somewhere. By Jove, we're gonna find that clock. Was that wrong to, for me to go to like a different world? Is that what I was trying to say? I know it's optional, but I kind of want to try it. Fourth clock. Not you. But like, what's the world? What if it means my real clock? <laughs> you have to solve the puzzle fast enough before it changes. <laughs> You're always at the mercy of the clock. You have to keep on changing it. It's like a race ag against time. Just constantly changing it. No, I can't make it up. Too slow. Wait, if it's mirrored, I, I think about this. If it's mirrored, right? Think about this. If it's mirrored, the, then, the, the, then the directions are different. So it'd be... Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. Up, right, up, right. Up, left, up, right. Up, right, up, right. What? Up, no, no, up, right, up, left. Left, up, right, up, left, up, left, up, up, right, up, right, up, left, up, left, up, right, up, right, up, right, up, left, up, left, up, right. Will you like me to write it in chat to help me remember? No, I have opposable fingers. I want you to enjoy the process or be frustrated by it. Both bring me joy. Up right, up left, up left, up right. Up right, up left, up left, up right, up left, up left, up right. Is this one of those red herrings? <laughs> Is this one of those red herrings? What's the point of binary, yeah? Huh? What is the point of binary? 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 The forgotten world. You know what? Maybe it's forgotten because everyone forgot the answer. I guarantee you the clock is in that room. I guarantee you. Or it could mean that the answer is behind the padlock in the mirror. Like, it could just be a be of be that. Okay, that's a bit disorienting. Um. Although I might not be able to find the clock, the place has had the power to place outside my realm of existence. No, it has to be here somewhere. So, okay, it's not in the Forgotten Realm. The Unknowable World. Maybe, if it, maybe it's an unknowable clock. This could be, this could be the worst. This could, this could be, this could be the, this could be an absolutely wrong answer. I have no clue. The cool world. Wait, was it on the unknowable or the cool world? I'm going to go to the mysterious world. Is there anything different? 
really can't tell if anything's different. Oh, you want the mysterious world? Because it's a mysterious manor. Like an escape room. It's a mystery, right? Alright. My guess was wrong. If I go to the cool world and there's no answer, it means that the clock is not inside that room. It could, could be in, in, in one of these rooms. It's somewhere in one of these rooms. In one of these worlds. Does anybody remember Halloween of last year? What, what, what worlds were there and what worlds aren't now? There needs to be some new room somewhere. We're going to the fib. We're gonna go to the Fibbin world. Okay, f f f Fibbin world. Where is the clock? There should be a fourth clock somewhere. But maybe this is not what it means. <laughs> like, but the, like it's it's maybe it, it is what it means because you use the photo. Because use the photo mechanic to take photos, right? But maybe it does mean this. Who, who meowed? Is there a clock in here? Maybe, maybe, maybe there's a there's a good clock in here. Right? What? I don't get it. Where could this extra clock be? It's in one of these worlds. One of these worlds is not like the other. What does it mean outside? Because there's, there's so many different meanings, right? It could mean that it's something that's a part of the puzzle. A.K.A. when we go into the mirror world and we solve that little thing behind the uh, thing. Uh, the, the, the medicine cabinet that would show us a new mirror. It could mean when we get behind the door. as a, 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 When we visit a new world, that's how we get that key. Like, it could be that all this is meaningless. I'm, I'm going back. I don't like being uh, alone, it scares me. Uh, we'll just, we'll solve it the way that I think it's meant to, to be solved. So what's undone? If I, if I look at this holistically, what is undone? Quite a few things, actually. This is undone. I don't know what this is. The binary thing is interesting too. Cause why why is there a binary? Why is there a binary? Uh okay, so okay, well I'll I'll find the eyes later. Why is there a binary? We'll figure out the order of this later. Why is there a binary? Are the ages of the people who died? Is their year of day is is their year important? Like could it be like binary and then you use the f the f the first three numbers to figure out the final digit? <gasps> it's my dog! Come back later when I made some more progress later. But then it's like nine. See, because then that idea puts kind of a stop on it. Because then it's like if you go one nine four, the binary for that would be so large, it'd be a much larger number. It wouldn't make sense. It has to be that all their ages would have to be below like nine to make it work, or whatever the base number system of the binary is. Well, I guess there's no base number system. But if you go all the way one to nine, right? And 9 is one of your digits, then you've already gone over because you overflow into 10 and you need one number, single digit number. So it's not binary there. So why do I have the binary? <laughs> what, what's the importance of binary?
that person's that they they're gonna cry. What is undone? Did that? Did this? I did this. I this. I, I did this with a notepad. I did the secret room. I feel like I've done everything. So quite literally, the only room left is downstairs. I've done this. Jesus, that scared me. Why is there a party? Party all night. Yeah, let's party. Let's uh, let's hang out and party, people. Oh yeah, you don't need a. The, you can take screenshots by just taking the, a photo camera, right? So, this is this is the one that's hard. This is this is the one that's tricky. It has to be about visiting other worlds. It has to be. Okay, let's try this backwards again. So if we do it backwards, oh, it's not up, it's down. I'm so stupid. You know what it is? Because it's it's all parallel. So you also go down. So down right, down left, down left, down right. There we go. I get it. Down right, down left, down left, down right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna report this pumpkin because I'm bad. <laughs> what the heck is this? What do you mean? This is when you call o over the phone. And you're like, hey, um, I'm kind of stuck over to like the, the, the escape room staff, but they went to go eat lunch. So they forgot that you were there. So now you're stuck in the escape room alone. <gasps> and then you can't get out. <gasps> no. So down. What if it's the same? What if it's the exact same code? Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. There's no way. No. Up, left, up, right, up, right, up, left. It's a parallel universe. So it's down, right, down, left. Down, left, down, right. Down, right, down, left. <laughs> Where's the binary coming? I don't know where the binary comes in. I don't get anything. <laughs> it's binary. <laughs> I'm not good at this. Also, there's different colored dolls. Red doll. Green doll. Red doll, green doll. A, B, C, D. Red doll, green doll. A, B, C, D. Amelia, Charlotte. Billy, Delilah. Amy, Catherine. Bob. Denny. How come Denny's no, no longer used it as a cool name? I'm I, I'm putting a coin. I'm gonna use a coin. You should try unlocking the dimensional lock. The world behind the mirror is similar to the normal world. Could the same cold from the normal world work? I'm trying my hardest. I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand. What do you mean? It's it's. <laughs> uh, rotates. Alright. No, do you start from the bottom? Is that why you start from the bottom bottom? Is, is, is that why? I don't... I can't believe it. You start from the bottom? Is that why? Is that why? So it'd be... Because the top is now the bottom. I get it. So stupid. So stupid. So... Up, right, up, left, up, 
left. Up, right, up. I'm so stupid. Okay, so now there's one more clock. There's a hidden clock somewhere in a different universe. I don't know what that means. Like, that's the thing that confuses me. And also, the code for the, for the safe outside must be based on this. But where in the world? <laughs> I don't know why. It's like I, only start, like, I only flip like half the things initially. I flip the left and the right. And then I realized I should flip the, the up. And then I never realized I should flip the down, too. I work in stages, right? It depends on the level of oxygen. It's like 20% 20, 20 oxygenated. And I'm like, okay, I'm getting closer. 30%, a little bit closer. 40%, we're getting closer. At 100%, I would, I would solve everything. This is, life would be better. Okay. There's supposed to be a fourth clock inside the manor all across the festival grounds, even in alternate universes. The time and the clock is the key that I need. Can search several places outside my realm of existence. Right? So, alternate universes. Is that the same as a realm? I don't know. But it's not here. We check the house, we check outside. We do both. There should be a, another clock somewhere. No? Right now, we're in the cool world. Woman! <laughs> Why is it so... I mean, I guess, listen. You should be excited about women. Right? It's important to be excited. But it's that level of excitement that also scares me, in a way. Right? It's like, what does it mean to be that excited? When what does a binary mean? Blue. What is the binary? What could the binary mean? Or rather, where is their binary? I don't think I've ever seen anything that's a binary. Maybe the numbers are not obvious, and maybe it doesn't matter yet. But we'll matter later. There's no way it's in the cool world. In a realm other than my own. A realm... The forbidden? It has to be the forbidden. What's the mana called? Shit. Wait a minute. This is an oddly entertaining escape room. It's very weird. I didn't think I'd be so wrapped up in it, but it is very nice. It is, however, extremely hard at times because I think I didn't get enough sleep. I'm gonna say I'm gonna blame it on uh, sleep uh, deprivation and sleep quality. It has to be the mysterious. 
it's mysterious to be stuck in the building. Right? <laughs> it's somewhere, but the clock, wait, the clock could be anywhere. He said he searched everywhere, including the, the campgrounds, right? There's, it has to be. It's an optional clock. It's optional. Do you know why it's optional? Because it involves the rest of the map. And you do go outside in the shed to go to the main world. I'm going to use coins. I read the note in the graveyard and opened the shed. The years are indicated by on some of the graves. I'm missing a digit indicated by squares. Does it remind you of any prior puzzles? God damn it. <laughs> no way. There's no way. There's no way. This, really? There's no way. <laughs> it's not, no. Okay. So every puzzle so far has been numbers that add up to, to 10, right? How the hell do you make that add up to, to 10? Oh my god. What? 1 8 8 6 is that is that it? One eight eight six or six eight eight one? I want to be wrong so it doesn't hurt as much. One eighteen eighty six. Isn't that like a witch trial number or something? I want to be wrong so it hurts less. Yeah, I'm wrong. Okay, it it it, it hurts so much less. So what other puzzle was like that? It was all the puzzles involving a missing number that had to add up to, to 10, right? So I tried to do it adding up to 10, but it didn't work. It's four digit numbers. It's a four digit number. So it should make sense. Like it should be like one. Or is it related to this, right? I don't know. Because then this would follow the same pattern. 1883 should be like 1882 instead. But I guess they didn't want to give away the answer. So it's more about 1, 8, 8, because 2 and 8, 2 and 8. 6. Or, do you, or is it... Is it uh, <laughs> 186? One eight eight six one, one, one one, eight eight six, six eight eight one. The order, the order is unknown. A B C D. I'm so stupid. Six, eight, one eight six eight one eight. I'm gonna go A B C D six eight one one eight six eight one eight six eight one one eight. That's why it's A B C D. Okay, so six eight one eight. I don't know what, what the dead children stand for. Six eight one eight six eight one eight. Wait, this isn't Phasmo. There's no ghost here. The only ghost that's here is the remnants of my brain cells. Listen, I know the number. I know it's A B C D, but I I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't... Uh... The, as indicated by the 1883 grave, the number should add up to 20. I'm gonna go lie down on the sofa for like two minutes. Beer break.
Okay, I'm done with my breakdown. I'm sorry. I, I forgot to pause. <laughs> As indicated by the 1883 grave, the number should add up to 20. I don't fucking get it. <laughs> I don't get it. I could see that being the case. If you take the 1 away from the 3, you add the 1 plus 1 to make 2882 to then add up to 1010, which then you add up to 20, to, to just 20, right? Like, I can see that being maybe the case. You add both numbers on both sides to add, you add both numbers on both sides to add them up to, to 20. <laughs> That's a good face. That's a good face. That's a good face. You, do you think I'm, do you think, do you think I'm full of sadness? Do you think I'm full of sadness? I think you think that I'm full of sadness. I can't believe it. I'm being <laughs> Oh god, they're taking photos of me. It's 6998 because both numbers added together equals 20. Six, okay. I, okay, sorry. I just, I will, I, 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 <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why this is so hard for me. I need to look at the eyeballs. Now, okay, this one, I know the answer. This one is like, I, I know. I get it. You know what it is? I was bamboozled by the, I was bamboozled by the square. And so I thought, there's no way the first two numbers, because I was like, that has to be a red herring, right? But I need to remember, everything is intentional. Everything, wow. You look like me. Wait, wait, wait. Can I take a photo of you? Can I, can I take a photo of you? I mean, you look the same, please. Look, we look the same. It's me and it's look, look, me and them. Look. They cheese. Stop, stop, stop. Why, why, why do you want to take a selfie? Come on, take a selfie. Come on, take a selfie. Take a selfie. Come on. Why are you running away from me? Please, I want to take a selfie with you. Please. Why are there so many people watching me? <laughs> look, look, let me look at your eyes. <laughs> You are so... You're so silly. You're so silly. I love your eyes. You and I have the same nose. I know what you feel like. How very creepy. <laughs> I love this game. It's actually such a treat. It's so fun. Okay. Why did I go inside here? I don't know. Okay, well, wrong. That was, that was a mistake. Oops. I'm so brave. You are so brave. Do you think I'm... Do you think I'm complacent? <laughs> Do you think I'm complacent? I think... I think this dog likes me. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, dog. No. Oh. No. Left. Hole. Right. Mouth. I need to see what the what the platforms are. Where are we? I need to see what the platforms are. It's specifically the platforms where you place them, I think, that matter towards the eyeballs. I think. Oh, wait a minute. We saw a bunch of guard we saw a bunch of those heads around the house. One in the hallway actually. That had no eyes. So are there more of those lying around? That would then belie an order? So do you need to find them around the house? Am I overcomplicating it again? Am I overcomplicating it again? If I don't see another Whoa! You are so cool. Mm. Left? No. Right? Yo. Left? No. Right? Yo. 
So Everything hurts. Everything genuinely hurts. We may need to punt one thing from the list, but we will but we will not punt the dating game. But I think we do need to punt at least one thing though. Is there anything about them that stands out? Anything at all? Because these are the ones that surround the pyramid. They surround the pyramid. What is, what is the intended order? I need to know which one is which again. I think mouth was... I forgot which one is the mouth. Is, is mouth both? Is mouth both? The mouth? Where am I going? The mouth is... None. The mouth is none. The mouth is none. The hook... Is left? Well, is it from my perspective or is it from its perspective? Mouth is none. The hook is right from its perspective. The arrow is both. The hook is left. Mouth, none. Arrow, full, hook, hook. Mouth, none, arrow, full, hook, hook. And there's still another clock to find. Mouth, none, arrow, full, hook, hook. Mouth, none, arrow, full. Mouth, none, arrow, full. Mouth, none, arrow, full. There we go. Because you, because you, because you go... You open both eyes. It's like the eye thing. So you, it's like the left, right eye thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, hello. You are so, I'm so, I'm so dead. I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. You must have a big brain. No, no, no. I'm, I'm cheating. I actually have no clue. I'm pretty sure it's like, you know, because you go from close to open and then you left right. What I don't get is why it's exactly left right. That's the thing I don't understand. That is a cool pumpkin. Man, people hide their cool pumpkins back here. Oh, that is beautiful. Simple. I'm a spooky ghost. <laughs> Eek. Happy Halloween. That's the symbol of... I thought that was the Resident Evil. That's, um... What is that? Is that Resident Evil or is that Zelda? Oh, that's good. What is that? <laughs> I don't like this. Well, I like it, but I'm afraid. That's what I'm saying. You wouldn't download a pumpkin. Eek. Well, uh, why'd you say eek? Oh. You are smart. Hey, thank you. Congratulations on making it out alive. Yay. Party all night. Woo. We made the chat. Happy Halloween. You did it. You puzzle scoundrel. Take the teleport back to lobby. Check this out. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Check this out. I'm gonna die. Let's... Let's do it together. <laughs> that sure was... A pretty haunted house. Ooh. 
<laughs> Look over there! It's puzzle hour. These are these are nice pumpkins. Okay, we need to, okay, now I need to do one final pumpkin. Before we sign off, I need to make a pumpkin that mogs people. And I need to place the pumpkin in a very inconspicuous area. That surprises them. How very happy. I sorry, I literally don't have hands. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna die. I love this. We have one final thing to do, which is we carve the pumpkin. And we make a mogging pumpkin. I need to I, I need to imagine what it's like to mog people. I've never mogged someone in my entire life. Is it mogging or is it mewing? I don't know. Giga Chad face. I need a reference for his face to really understand this. That's perfect. That is absolutely perfect. Okay, so we take this. Our pumpkin. Oh, I, I need the guy who like purses his like lips like. You know what I mean? From like Zoolander or something. Yeah, okay. So we do all three different versions of it. So I need to get the right sh head shape. Uh, right head shape. I vaguely remember there being some limit to how often you could do this. See, the problem is that I have no art skills. So it only, it, it, so it only really gets worse from here. All right, this is when it finally ends. But this, it, this is why I kind of love this game. There's something fun about the fact that you are in a shared place with people and you just get to hang out making stuff. It's very cool. And it's, it's so fun because like everyone's there at the same time and then the escape room uses a lot of the same mechanics that you're used to from the main game. So like everybody gets to, gets to do it and it, it, it's a good touch. It's a very good touch. I need to do eyebrows. And I enjoyed that escape room. It was actually very solid. Like, if you, if you told me that that was a standalone game, I'd be like, this is a great standalone game. Which makes sense, because the, the dev of this game made a short hike. And uh, uh, that, game, that game was good. It was good. Uh, it's all before my streaming time, though. So you never got to see me play. How many, how many eyebrows does this guy have? Holy moly. A lot of eyebrows, Jesus. But it's crazy how expressive people can be in this tool. This game. Like, it's so crazy how people are so good at drawing and... But it feels effectively like a... Uh, You ever try to chop vegetables? <laughs> no, it's crazy, but like my 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 earliest jobs were as in the kitchen. And one of the dishes we had was I had to get really good at chopping flowers out of carrots. And uh I'm gonna tell you right now, I don't know how the fuck you're supposed to cut a flower out of a carrot. Still to this day, I'm really bad at it. But it was so important to the dish that if I messed up, like it no one would be happy. Not the customers, not the people. I had to make the flour out of a carrot. I was not allowed to cut like our like the arrangement of it too. Like I had to cut the thing full on as like f like from carrot to flour. There was no in between. I can't make a nose. I don't know. If this is a good nose. I'm gonna <laughs> like if this guy walked up to mog to mog you, would you be? Would you be like, you know what I mean? Like the Moggy meme, the Moggy meme face gesture. Is it mewing? Like if he, you know what I mean? Like he, if you do the Moggy gesture face, right? And you do it and you see this guy, I, I don't think you would feel very, in, very intimidated by what you're seeing. But I get how people do like textures now. Very simple shapes. You know what it is? You, do you know what opens my, my, my artistic mind? The color theory. It was the thing about the color theory. That thing has changed how I view uh, shapes permanently. I think I understand now. I get it now. That thing has single-handed changed me. I know art now.
Like, look at that hair. Look at it. Shit, there's a curve on his eyebrow. Okay, there's a curve in here. Fuck, that's such a nice curve. No wonder this guy is the Chad face. Jesus Christ. Like, he doesn't even look real. You know what's funny, actually? I was reading this one Wuxia, uh, uh, w w a webtoon about, like, this, like, really cool, like, character that's, like, really buff and, like, muscular. And then I stopped because I was like, oh, I I'm, 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 I'm going to go grab a snack, right? So I went to go grab a snack. <clears throat> and I stopped on the page where, like, multiple nude people uh, or, or like very barely clothed men were fighting, so they were very very hot and hot at the moment, right? But they were also grappling in the side of it, so it it looked like they were grappling each other. Um, then uh, I had to help somebody like with some thing with some technical issue, so I was like, okay, fine. So I went to help them, um, and then they I didn't know that it was like that on my phone. I I forgot, so I had to get the Wi-Fi password, which I have on my phone. Open my phone, and we're both looking at my phone. So imagine that this, like, 70-year-old person staring at my phone. They see a bunch of, like, naked dudes, like, grappling each other. <laughs> and then I, I just kind of, like, casually swiped away. But, like, in hindsight, I was like, what, what do they think about that? You know, like, because they're old. You know, they have their... They rarely see my wife. Like, do they even think, like, I'm actually married? You know what I mean? Like... Is that enough of an eyebrow? I, I, I guess so. I guess some more shape over here. A bit, a, a, a bit more substance over here. Oh, yeah. That's too much substance. I really messed up. See? You, you know what it is? Don't mess with something perfect. Maybe we should. In here. Because the eyebrows are kind of thick on the chat face. There we go. That's okay, I think. It'll... Yeah, that's okay. I'm going to... I gotta have to get the hairline. So it's like... I don't know. In relation to that, it's like here. And then here. This is the worst chat I've ever seen in my life. Not like the not like the reference image, but my own. Like if if you saw mine, you'd you'd be like, oh, like you're the Chad, right? It's like meeting your heroes in in the real life. It's like, oh, like you're that person. Wow, that's um. Hmm. This beard is unreal. There is no way this beard is like that. What the fuck? I've never seen actually how his beard looks like. That's crazy. What? What do you mean? Dude, there's no way this dude has an... Int there's no way they have skin like this. What? It's, <laughs> it's, actually, just, it's actually just fucking Squidward. It's just handsome Squidward. What the fuck? There's no way you look like this. Oh shit, that's a nose. Oops. Go past the nose. Yeah, I'm glad too that I was able to, to like tell you guys, like, I will give in kind as well. And again, it's fine to make fun of me, but like you gotta be ready for it, right? And if you don't understand the impact of your words, it's like sorry buddy, like you gotta Maybe you should just rethink what you're saying then, because what you're saying really does sound like that. It's, it's, it's surprising. And it's not bad to sound like that in the context of the stream, right? Like, it's just, you know, like, it's funny. Okay, this guy doesn't look very good anymore. <laughs> oh, God, I messed up. Okay, we need to think about this. I think I start slowly. And it's fine. It's fine to say those things here. It's fine to, like, poke jest at me. Because I'm going to do it too. But then you can't get all defensive and be like, why would you say that? It's like, buddy, 
you and I are the same. Like, like what you did and what you said, uh, just, just the exact same. And I'm glad that I got to tell people that because, boy, oh boy. I know it's hard to, you know what I mean? Like I, like it's hard to sort of like figure out what to say without sounding a bit like dickish about it. But like, that's fine. That happens. But I should be allowed to make fun of that. <laughs> and I'm going to make fun of that because it's like, dude, like, I don't know what to say about this, but like, it seems kind of like a... Because like, it's fun to poke jest and like, you know, with like, what, what are we doing? It's fun to poke jest at each other in a very joking, teasing, but also kind of like, you know, not really asshole-ish. Well, kind of asshole-ish way, right? Like, it's... Sometimes it's fun to be a little dickwad to each other. This guy's like double cranium. That's no way. There, there's no way this guy is double cranium. This guy has got to have the lumpiest head I've ever seen in my life. And I mean that as a compliment. Like his head is, th his head is throbbing. In the his head is throbbing in the best way possible. He's so good. And I refuse to be uh, nicer about it just because, again, like it's, I feel like anybody reading that would, would understand it's like the same tone of like a jesting, poking fun thing. Because again, if you come in right as I fail and you say, why did I think you were good at puzzles? Like that's funny, but I'm going to respond to it too. And you can't lie. What I said was genuinely good and funny. The reason why you think I'm bad at the reason why you think I'm good at puzzles is because I'm better than you. Like that, that, that's such a perfect exchange. You can't get upset at that, chat. You just can't get upset at that. There's no way that you believe that what I said was any worse than what you said. And if you do, then you have to realize there's something wrong with you. You gotta change. You gotta figure it out, man. Do you see him? I see him. He's taking shape in my head. Like, you see the shape, right? You see what I'm going for. This is it. Now we just need the rest of his, like, neck. Because there's a delineation between his, his, his hair and his shape. Fuck, his ears are, his ears are gonna look so weird. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, God, his ears are gonna look so fucking weird. I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus. And you know what? Maybe it sucks to learn that we're just bad at communication, right? It sucked for me at first. It made me realize that like, oh wait, even if I do that, just because I mean it well, doesn't mean that it doesn't come out the way. You know what it is? It's, it's a problem that many people have with the conversation stuff in, 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 in general. They could mean it in the nicest way possible, right? But it doesn't matter how you mean it. It matters how it comes across. It's like that whole thing of like, we judge ourselves by our intent, but we can only judge others by, by their action, right? And it's like, what your action was, was no different than somebody who's like coming in to be like an asshole. But I, but I get that. That's why I think it's in jest. So like, we make fun of each other there. And is that so wrong? To then break down over it inside chat? Like, I, I feel like that's like too much. So I'm glad that I got to yell at you to make sure that you understand where we stand. <laughs> because now it's very clear how equal we really are. Is that a good neck for him? I don't really know. But I want him, I want him to mog people. This does look very like mog-like. Like I feel like if he mogged me, like now I feel like if he mogged me, I would feel very afraid. So his neck is a bit like Mike Tyson's, where it's like mostly muscle, and thus a lot of back issues from what I heard. I heard his, his like spine is all messed up. Look at that. That's a good, that's good stuff. And we had to get this like pectoris, or it's like shoulder muscle, whatever this thing is. It, it, it's, it's like a support muscle over here.
And the only reason why I'm like harping on, on this is because I want to make it very clear. If you think that I'm the one who is being mean more than you, you're sorely mistaken. What I'm saying is that you and I are both the same. You just don't recognize that you're the same as me. You're in denial. And I don't want you to be in, de in, in denial. Because then you're lying about me. <laughs> so you're right now, we're both the problem. And that's okay to be both the problem. Oh, fuck. His neck has way much more of a curve to it. I just didn't recognize. Oh, you know what? You see this line on the pumpkin? It's perfect. It's like his real actual neck muscle. Holy shit, look. It's like a guide. Oh, heck yeah. Look at that. Right? This Adam's apple over here. I guess I'm gonna get shaded, I guess. Maybe, I, okay, I fucked up. <laughs> should I use this for shading? I think I should use that for highlights. This scraping is for highlights. So this whole thing should be highlighted. Oh, it also deforms it like a, like a weird muscle. Oh yeah, heck yeah. And I get it. You know, it's hard to feel to criticize. It's hard to be criticized. But like, it had to be done. It has to be done. I don't know how to shade. Not one bit. I know there's something about color values and like getting like a certain color to things, but I don't really get it. Now he just looks like he's raw. Like incredibly raw. Knife work is child's play. Shading, that is where a real artist makes their mark. I'm not that artist. <laughs> we stick with knife work. <laughs> We stick with our handy dandy knife work over here and we just chop we just chop this shit up. We chop it up and we make it you notice the top of his head is now a bit too small and maybe a little bit too dented. If you it really depends on where you look at him from. Look at him from like down here, it looks fine. Look at him from up here, he doesn't look fine, but it's okay. Nobody will ever look from from the bottom. It's fine. I'm sure people will respect the art and look at it from the top side view only. That's good. It's fine. Like this. Yeah, I really enjoyed this year's events. Again, that escape room was really, really good. That was a very hard escape room. I, I, I liked being spoiled in some places, which was cool. That was nice. But it's why the crystal ball is there. I enjoy having the crystal ball as my optional go-to for spoil. Um, and I'm, but I am glad that you can look away from what people say. It's not like in real life where you have to like read what they say. Here, you're allowed to look away if they're about to spoil you. So it's nice to, it's nice to, it's easy to avoid the problems. And that puzzle was really good. I'm going to use every single mechanic that you would expect from the game, which is interesting. It used the camera mechanic. I thought the traveling realm thing was literally you had to travel between the, the different worlds. Uh, which is to say, maybe I was a little bit too wild with my thinking. Wait, I never solved that, did I? I didn't solve that. Wait a minute, we're not done. I didn't solve it. Wait a minute. I never solved the, the puzzle with the traveling realms. Wait a minute. We have, we have to go back. We'll do Frontiers of the Mind tomorrow. We'll do Sucker for Love later today. <laughs> oh god, I ruined him. I, I don't know. I don't know anymore. Let's make his hair. I am the Chad. Are you, are you Chadley? I can't really tell if you're very Chadley, you know? Like, you, you don't really look Chadley. I am the Chad. I mean, not tomorrow, sorry. Monday? Whatever day I'm actually back. One day is for a bachelor party, but I can't, I can't, I can't remember when. Be sure it's tomorrow.
POV, you've been tasked with designing a really cool um, box design image for those, like, you know, those, like, graying hair dye products for, like, men. But you've never done art in your life. So you say, yeah, I can do it. This is awful. This is with a reference. This is with a reference. I don't understand. How am I bad at this? Why am I so bad at this? <laughs> okay, I just, I don't know anymore. Okay, I don't know how to do lifts. So we'll just do the teeth now. We'll just move on to like teeth. We'll just move on to the teeth. Are people's teeth like symmetrical, bottom top? Like it's like... There. Are. Okay, so it's just gap here. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh heck. Oh jeez. Oh heck. Oh jeez. Oh heck. How many teeth do you have? So you have like the buck teeth. Okay, that's like your. All right, that's a side. That's that weird side tooth that no one really cares about. That's your canine. Uh, so now we're now at the front of the canine. Alright, then you gotta go past the canine. Now you're in that other tooth that no one cares about. Alright, now you're getting to your molars. That's this is this is this is the useful tooth. This is the first of the many useful tooth. <laughs> he looks so beautiful. He looks so beautiful. <laughs> oh, he looks so beautiful. You look so beautiful. I love you. You're so beautiful. <laughs> You're so beautiful. I can't look at you. <laughs> oh, I love it. All right, give me a second. My bad. I'm back. Uh, we are not getting any closer to, to making this this person. Like, th like the the outline was good. Okay, the outline was was good. The, like the neck was good. Then we got into the teeth. Okay, th I mean, then we got into the beard. Then it started to look kind of weird. Then we got into the teeth, and that was when it all went downhill. Like, I, I don't know what the fuck do you how do you do how do you make teeth? UV, you're a dentist in like the 13th century. How will I replace these beautiful teeth? It's about perspective. I, I have to get close. It's perspective. I need to get even closer. Even closer. Right? Because it's perspective. So it, 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 it's a foreshortening of it, right? Same with the, look at the very small one over here. <laughs> uh, yeah. And then you gotta do like the teeth like this. So it's like the, it's like all the teeth. He's got, he's got nice teeth. He has a straight teeth that like form like a razor shark. Like a, it's, it's like a razor shark thing over here. So a nice outline that goes like this into this. That is... The more I do this, the more I realize I should have stopped like a while ago. You know what I mean? To just not butcher his teeth anymore. And I need to match the same, because it's the same pattern, right? Same pattern of buck tooth to and the bottom buck tooth, right? Same thing. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing. 
Oh, man. You're so beautiful. You're so beautiful. You're my beautiful Chad. <laughs> Let's cut the eyes. Let's cut the eyes out. No, now we, now we, now we do the eyes. It's a little bit of bit, it's a bit of a gap here. This guy has some beautiful fucking eyes, dude. What the hell? This guy is so goddamn beautiful. Why is he so like good good looking? Jesus. No one person should look this this good. Too much power. Right. But he has like a good stock portfolio too. Well, does anyone really? He is showing his eyes a little, so I'm going to go like this. Right? I'm going to go like this. Okay, here we go. Am I ready to fuck this up? So beautiful. How do I do this eye? Oh, shit. What happened here? <laughs> it's, it's like someone punched him in the eye. <laughs> like not 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 the original, but like mine. What happened here? <laughs> Why is he so dented? <laughs> oh man, I should I should have never started with, with the forehead. You know what I mean? Like this is the rest of the good picture. This is like a draft. This is a rough sketch line that I never bothered to like clean up. Gotta get this iris really tight. There we go. <laughs> okay, there's no brush size yet, so I think we just need to... We just need to make do with this. There's no brush size, so I think we just need to cut out his entire eyeball here. Yeah, it's good. It's really good. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I need to think of the light as a way to show transparency. Like, that's the thing that I'm not really thinking of. I, I, wish, I, had, I wish I had an artist's eye, right? It's something that I've been trying to train myself to have, but boy, is it hard to train yourself to look at the world that way. Because they look at the world and they see a whole different world that I can't see. And it makes me jealous, you know? I'm going to start an AI startup. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm so jealous of you. I'm going to do an AI startup. Fuck this. All right. This is um, it's a bit of a disaster. I'm not going to not gonna lie to you. It's a bit of a disaster here, but it's fine. He's seen better days. He's seen better days. Cut the like the beard shapes here. We don't want to do hair for like beard now, which is nice. I'm gonna need a shit ton of these. Oh god, this is very time consuming. Thankfully there's a save button. See, okay, now my vision is making more sense, right? At first, I was like, all right, I don't think this is working. And now that I started drawing the beard, now it's starting to really take shape. Because now I can really show what this person looks like. You know what I mean? Like, it, it, it was just missing a bit of that, like, contrast. It was, missing, it was missing texture. I've heard an artist talk about texture, the way that, like, children do when they ask for the, for the, for the chicken nugget. And not the french fry. I'm like, I, I get that, because I'm, I'm basically that, yeah, basically. Now we have texture. Problem is, I don't know how much texture is too much texture. 
It's like silk. Like, do you, can you really have too much silk? I, I don't think so. I strive to have as much as I can. Oh, fuck, he's mogging. He wouldn't have his mouth open. I'm so stupid. Can we salvage this? He's mogging. He wouldn't open his mouth. That's ruining his like, facial structure. Fuck. Fuck, I didn't think about that. Fuck. Fuck. I didn't, I didn't think about that. Do I just change like tact and I just say it's just Chad? I don't wanna. I mean, to be fair, this 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 whole concept is only understandable to those under like the age of like what ten. So I feel like this is just such a weird concept that I know of now. Can't stop mogging. Whatever. Yeah, well, I'll come back to this later. <laughs> I'll go to Vince the Festival. We need to find the clock. <laughs> we'll find the clock first. Fuck it. We'll find the clock first, and then we'll figure out the rest. Should be a hidden clock somewhere. A minute you know who i know what, what, what i know where the clock is the top of the building there was this um door on top that was closed it was closed with a key lock up there as if to signify that the manor had something more as if to signify there was a little hidden secret in there that you couldn't get to without the right armaments Tools. Things. Yeah, here we go. Why else is there a mushroom patch here? Think about it. why else is there a mushroom patch here? It doesn't make any sense. You kidding me? <laughs> well, that's a bit of a sticky situation. Ow. I, I want to place my pumpkin yet. If I place it too... Because if you place a pumpkin too early, right? Everyone's going to remember and vote on the worst version. Drum lessons. 25 per hour. <laughs> like, is that a real ad? The last time we saw that, I think it was a real ad. In like a place in Canada. In Vancouver. It was in, Van it was in Van Van Vancouver. Yeah. You should go there to get some lessons. Go to drumming.ca to get some lessons. Now that's a pretty good domain name too, honestly. Of all the domain names to get, that's the best one. Hidden clock. Hmm. Maybe this is just so you could vote. And maybe I'm thinking of this the wrong way. Where am I right now? I'm in the Forgotten World. Did I go to the Forbidden World? I did. Did I? I don't know. Forgotten has nothing. Forbidden had mine something. And it could be anywhere. Because he mentioned even the Festival Grounds. So it could be anywhere. Not just inside. Or... I'm doing it again. That thing. The thing where I consistently give myself a red herring that, and, and thus a headache. Hmm. Could be. Killer cats. 
with bubble tea on Adelaide. It's weird too, because like I, I feel like this already had like a very good uh, system for like enticing you to play this fully. It's not like this wasn't good before. This it just got better, and I don't understand how they can consistently make it better. Every single time, it just gets better and better. I don't know how they do it. So it's not here. So maybe I'm wrong. So let's go to the unknowable world. Wait a minute. Maybe this is what it means by shifting realms. It's gets to look like daytime, right? Oh, that's cute. Maybe that's what it means. Because you get to go to daytime. And you get to see what's inside the house at daytime. No. That wouldn't make any sense. That wouldn't make any sense. For family friendly manner. What does that mean? What's so diff what's so different about this? <laughs> Maybe it is inside the manor then. Right? I was like, where could the clock be? I'm too obsessed with this. I need to stop this. But I feel like we're so close, yet so far. I feel like we're just there, you know? We go to different realms. There should be a fourth clock somewhere. We have all three clocks on each floor. Same clock as before. Where's the new clock? The binary thing is also confusing to me, because like, wh when was this ever useful? Reading binary is very cool and easy. I don't want to brute force it, because it feels stupid too. Wait a minute, even in alternate universes, oh my god. It's not a universe thing. It's specifically outside my realm of existence. What, what does it mean by realm of existence? Alive or dead? It means if they're alive or if they're dead. Fourth clock. I didn't really get that. I, I just didn't see that word. I, 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 I glazed over it. In my realm of existence. So there's a different realm to think about. What is a realm? Place of being? Living or dead? It also be day or night. Is there a clock in here? You win! Ganyong! Winner! You know what? We'll figure it out eventually. I'll do it at some point in the future. Uh, thanks for watching the Ghost Town Pumpkin Festival. What a great little game. Such a funny little weird crazy game about just being in the Ghost Town Pumpkin Festival and, and get to hang out. 
It's really cool, actually. I think the escape room was, fant was fantastic, and it's always a good treat to come back to this every single Halloween. It's a bit like just hanging out with, with, with people for the heck of it, right? Uh, I'm curious to see what happens during, ha during Halloween as well, because there's always some special event there. I have no clue if I missed it last time, if I saw it, I can't recall. So I'm curious to see it this year. I'll be right back, and we'll move on to the, to the next game. See you in about five minutes. Beer Enjoy the Escalda music. <laughs> 